shit. Okay, so they're all gone then. Well, we are using this today then. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Testing, testing, one, two, three, one, two, three. I'm testing. Hello, everybody. If you're in here already, good to see you. Gonna be coming up with some uh, melee at one of the first evac tournaments of the year. My name's Kaiser. I set up all the stream and whatnot. You can come out to evac every Wednesday and Friday. Uh, we're not in the fixed student lounge anymore. I got to change that. I that, that one slipped. But um, we're not in the fixed student student lounge anymore, as you can see. We're actually in the old Adelaide Uni Bar. So that's pretty hype. That's pretty hype. Um, so yeah, look at look at all this space. We got like a stage and everything, man. Get at this! Look at look at look at this place, man! Like, oh, it, it's so good! It's so good! Um, it's a yeah, pretty pretty exciting, kind of, kind of. All right, uh, let's just get some more headroom. Oh, that's pretty good, then. That's pretty good. Oh, that's not too bad. Yeah, that's pretty good there. All right, well, um, I should post this stream to places 
real quick. Um, in the meantime, if you're in here, thanks for stopping by. It's, uh, it's been real. Um, we're going to be getting our first rounds on stream very, very soon, so stay tuned. Streaming. Alright, first. Evac. SSBM tournament of the year. Yeah, yeah, so good, dude. No, no, I said to Muska, it's live. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I just need someone here. sharing out the stream and then we'll be good. Okay, I think we should be good. I definitely like was looking up projectors going, man, these things are expensive. That, <laughs> that shit's got like two. Yeah. It's like that fucking projector. How not? What the? Holy it's God. got like two HDMIs. It's got everything we could want. It's got so many inputs. It's, it's so good. We could run fucking NES games in that shit. <sighs> Can we? Well, like we could. It's got a yellow and it's like. It's what, got would all we, of them. what would we run there? I don't know, probably Tetris, just because that's what Cause, the people cause, want. Because we can. Mario. Oh, true, true. Super Mario Brothers 2. Jump on the hype. Just be like, yeah, we're playing Tetris. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, no. <laughs> Play rats. I think you mean right. yeah. Senor Rats? Yeah, I, I'm not finding that E button on the keyboard. <laughs> oh, no, this is a like standard keyboard. I can actually figure shit out. All right, true, true. Can uh, you find the S? Oh, wait, that is the true name. Why did that one... Oh, I'm going to need you to say, like, everything technical that's going on. Yeah, so I can only say, sure. Like, oh, nice. Yeah, Sh shine uh, back here. See? <laughs> hey, yours came up. Nice. Oh, see? Let's go. All right. So I'm assuming we're going to be watching 
Peach Falco. Which is one of them, Ca like, Ca even... Can Peach? I've yeah. been seeing Captain like, Black Melee in, like, two years. So. Yeah, she generally was like, I'm going to pick up this new character and then have Peach as a secondary. But she <laughs> kept doing it so often, eventually <laughs> she the, just the figured out... It's like just the, yeah. yeah, okay, okay. Right. Uh, I'm assuming hand wellness. Yep. Yep. Yeah, 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 the, the, the double down smash. <laughs> uh, that's, that's a classic Peach. <laughs> the advanced. <laughs> uh, I personally, like, play Sheik, don't hold A. Right. Just practice Zelda for yep, 30 yep, seconds. Yep, yep, yep. Wait, where's our like? Where's our levels here for like audio here? Oh, I don't want to fuck with that. Yeah, I, mean, I don't either. Yeah, like, <laughs> right, let's, let's not touch it. Yeah, we'll, we'll break something. Yeah, we'll that will definitely break something. Yeah. So, do you know which overlays we're doing? This is some man. Yeah, probably. <laughs> All right, let's. So that'll be in game one. That's uh, turned around in game one. Three and four do nothing. Okay. I'm all assuming right. five is, yeah. yeah. Look at this look shit. At I got all the technology. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. All right. Well, back to eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So who did Catherine used to play? Who did she cycle through? So she beach? cycled through, Fal she played Falcon for a long time, and then she tried. That's, that's what I remember. Yeah. From, from like and her Falcon wasn't bad, but it was like, you knew it wasn't really going to take that next step. <laughs> right, yeah. And Falco had the same kind of problem. And then, but then she played Peach a bunch, and like, she almost made it out of pools of Big Cheese. <laughs> like, and she was in a pool with Kai and um, Zai. Respect, who, respect. Who, who like, came ninth and seventh. Respectable. So, yeah. She definitely like, went to game three with Zai. Yeah, that's awesome. So, it's getting pretty good. Battlefields. Yeah. I assume it's pretty standard for this matchup. Well, no, usually as Peach, you try to, like, piss them off into choosing between FOD, Battlefield, or FD. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, right. But Catherine not doing that for some reason. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Kai goes for babysit. Doesn't get anything for it. Yeah, he's, he's just chilling at the moment. Yeah. All right. But he gets that. knocked down, so... <laughs> Could have all been over for him. Yeah. Oh, he's going to slide off. He's nuts. Oh, easy. Oh, okay, yeah. Easy, easy. That was bad up B then. I was like, that forward smash point hit, and she's doing the thing <laughs> where space around that, and I'm like, I've been watching too much of Arda. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Good shield, it's, but she, like, she, she, she had, had an air. Yeah. And just, I'm dead. Trust yeah, me, not. Gosh, <laughs> <laughs> that, that, you gotta, you gotta delay. <laughs> well, like, he could have done it, he just needed to delay, eh, delay the second strike. Yeah, yeah. Does that even kill him, Battlefield? Yeah, like, oh. if you're high enough. <laughs> yeah, right. Shit's yeah, got like a oh, oh. real good bait. Oh, yeah. This is that one. Good ang. And yeah, the classic problem of how does Peach contest top lap off? Uh, with great difficulty. Uh, yeah. Can she do it properly this time? <laughs> the counter? Is she insane? No. No, no, unfortunately. No. That's uh, not a real thing. You know, it looks like it should be, though. It, yeah, but <laughs> it's, it's just not. It's like if it landed, it's like, oh my god, Catherine, see? But. Unfortunately. And Kai like kind of invincible through it as yeah, well, so he didn't yeah. take the damage of yeah. like top and edge guard or anything like that. Oh, oh, he's, oh he's nuts! Oh, he's nuts! What we got? Oh. Just trying to get out of the corner. Ledge dash to get a yeah, hit. The yeah, classic. Yeah. Oh, good shield puck laser. Oh, that actually hit it too. Yeah, like you shoot him super low. <laughs> Sometimes you just get he's a hit for no reason. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's a soccer. Oh, I can't believe that shield grabbed him. Uh, uh, interesting. Yeah. Interesting decision. Probably just mash side B and yeah, it's got a bad frame for it. Yeah. yeah. Can't power shield while you're already in shield. Oh, yeah, that's not a good that's spot uh, to not have a double jump or a float. I don't know how she used the float. That's a new. No, no, that's one for the ages. <laughs> Check the tapes. Oh. Yeah. Good DIY. Yeah. Couldn't get anything off it. Oh. That was a big knockdown, but she just waited for... Waited too long. Yeah, yeah. for like an eternity in melee time. <laughs> it was just like he had enough time for I, shield. Uh, I, I still saw it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice one. Yeah. Oh. Damn, pal. She's, she's out of there. Is she the most intelligent yeah. Peach player of all time, though? Oh, she is. Look at that. I'm shocked he didn't run up down tilt. Oh, that was a <laughs> great reverse there. What the fuck? Oh, my God. Platform. Intelligent. But yeah, Kai just kind of goes legend. Yeah. Right. I wonder if that was invincible. Probably not. Probably just a good hitbox. Is Kai sick enough to get this? Uh, 
no. No. <laughs> yes. Back air, yeah. Gotta love back air. Back air's a good move. Yeah. Does everything, really. Yeah. It definitely does, like, most of the things. If Akka had only shown him back air and laser. He'd still be a pretty decent character. He'd yeah. still be top eight. Yeah. That's crazy. Like, that's probably enough to beat Falcon. <laughs> I think just laser anyway. Isn't that the whole game? Well, he power shield. Yeah, it's yeah, it's more like the fact that when you hit him with the down air, Falcon goes, oh, damn, that was a stock. <laughs> <laughs> and he doesn't have any, like, Fair shield options. Yeah, yeah. It's like you hit his shield with down air, and it's like, well, I have to roll or pray. <laughs> That they mess something up and I yeah. get like instant up air out of shield. Yeah. Alright. How good is uh, Catherine's uh, train grabbing? We'll, we'll find out. I wonder if he, she's watched the like Squid Hugs documentary where Squid teaches his roommate how to train grab. <laughs> I, I've seen it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm like, surely she's seen it. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh, yep, yep, yep. 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 Oh, you know what? I mean, like, decent damage, but... Yeah. Eh. And that turn up's never going to do anything. The Falco RP just always beats it. Yeah. Like, unless you pull a good turn up. True, true. Because it's got to be... It's the clank thing. You've got to be, like, 9% more or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, they're living in. They're all on. So that was really good space around that back air. Yeah. She's out of there. you got to float that shit. <laughs> Stay low and all that. Alright, it sucks. Yeah, that was alright. It's pretty good. Up throw up air. What the fuck? What is this fox? No, it was fucking the film clubs. It, it was there. Yeah, I found. Look at this mixer. I know. It's crazy. Alright. Down air, back air. Uh, yeah, you don't really get anything at that percent, do you? I think Catherine was just feeding for a grab and Kyle was just like, nope. But she, mean, she got it anyway. Yeah. I mean, this is why Smash Ultimate has four extra frames of lag when you hit the <laughs> and try to grab it. <laughs> it's like, it's fucking, Sakurai didn't want no more Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, yeah, nah, yeah. this is bullshit. Let's stop that. That was good shit from Kai. I mean, it was a good drift, but Catherine could have covered it. She just needed yeah. to cancel her float so she could nair again. Yeah. Or even just, like, jab or something. It doesn't take much to kill Falco once he's, like, in up B Ah, true. Jab was just, like... Yeah, could be dead. Yep, good turn up. Intelligent turn up. But now she's got this problem, yeah. I'm shocked that Kai ah. went the right way, it didn't matter, but like, yeah. usually when you get down smash twice like that, you are super dead off the other side. <laughs> <laughs> or like you get yeah, the stage like spiked plan. or something. Ooh, the an airplane. Oh, he's nuts. But he's dead. He's not nuts enough. Yeah. If only he was a little bit more sick. Yeah. <laughs> then maybe. Yeah. yeah. Uh, another three years, maybe he'll be <laughs> Yo, Twitter? Twitter combos? Nah. Nah. Tell you, tell you what. He's not Axe. You put, you, put, you put that on Twitter, you're, a, you're an embarrassment. Yeah. Oh, yep. There we Ooh, go. Up smash. Interesting. That almost killed as well. Would forward smash have connected? Uh, maybe. Because mm. that would have been cool. Yeah. yeah, that back is good. Good shit. All right. Hit that one. Why not? Kai takes it. Yeah. Because he is sick enough. Yeah. <laughs> sick enough. <laughs> oh, that, that, that'll do, yeah. That'll do. <laughs> Kai, you're right. sick. He's not listening. Uh, right. he, he knows he hits a backer. He knows he's sick. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> yeah? No. Yeah. No, it's not, yeah. bro. So, yeah. yeah. Kai found his phone in his hand. Let me know. We got him. Kai, you can, you can sub out if you want. Yeah. <laughs> I thought... <laughs> the audio's good. Yeah, we can yeah. hear everything quite well. Do you want to squeeze it? Yeah. Good. I got it. Uh, yeah, because that actual right. Smash Ultimate yeah, people <laughs> showed up. Games on stream. Welcome to EVAC, dude. <laughs> this, why is that so? Yeah, I don't know why the sign's like yeah, in the middle there. I don't know <laughs>
Um, so it's pretty much how we always run it is that we will run a tournament alternating between melee and ultimate once every two weeks because yeah, yeah. we've got um, EVAX game of the week in the gap weeks. So this week we're doing melee tournament and then next week will be a break week. Uh, week after that will be an ultimate tournament. But every week we always do friendlies here at the very least. Um, and it's always just bring your own controller. If you've got a switch set up, bring that as well if you got it. We've got a lot of the monitors here already and a lot of people bring in monitors like already as well. And yeah, just basically bring your bring a setup if you got it. Bring your controller. Um, be a become a member of Evac. It, it, to, seeing as your first time here, that's all good. Um, eventually, if you are going to keep coming to these, we would really appreciate if you did become a member of Evac. A lot of the people here aren't uni students or anything like that. Um, yeah, neither. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. After the week, yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically. So the orientation week for all the new students. Yeah, yeah. Um, so when we get like new people in, that'll probably be when people are gonna be like, all right, you gotta sign up to Evac if you wanna keep coming. But don't worry about it that for now. We'll bring it up when it happens. Um, just yeah, have fun, talk to people, get some advice. Yeah, I'm guys, that's it. Ready? He used to play a lot back in the day, like a couple years ago, kind of around the same time I joined. So like, same time as like the level of the people who were running things joined. Um, but yeah, he's he's fine. He's uh, he's still like, he, he plays mainly just for fun, basically. Yeah. yeah. Also run this space is open on Wednesday as well. Um, and that's just pretty much friendly for both games. Not as many people come to that, but it's still worth coming to. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and the only other thing is uh, we run like monthly tournaments on Sundays on Tuesday. Yeah, yeah, so that's this Sunday coming up. Yeah. Anyway, I gotta same place. Yeah, we'll be in the same room. All right, everyone, what's up? Uh, Kaiser's is back on the mic, and we're going into game one of Muscat versus... Uh, can we can we stop calling him Funny Slime? <laughs> can uh, he, we? Is there always when, when is he going to get a good name? When is yeah. Samus Guy going to get a good name? But he, he's, he's Lord on the... It's got TF on Twitter. Uh, I don't know which Fox is who, but I'm going to assume... Muscat is default. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's a good call. That's my, uh... Yeah, I reckon that's a fairly good one. Fair assumption. Yeah. Anyway, we'll put, we'll put SA Funny Son on the stream, but I'm keeping his Twitter the yeah. same. Uh, love yourself. In the commentary and all yeah. that shit. Oh, that was an interesting re-grab. I wonder how that DI worked, because I feel like I never see them that occur at, like, top of Fox Tourist. Yeah, possibly. Um, yeah, maybe it's just a battlefield specific thing that rarely comes up. I don't uh, know. Maybe. Um, yeah, by the way, stream, let us know how the audio is, whether or not the the game or the microphones need to go up or down, yeah. and we'll adjust it. Yeah, funny sound has got to shorten those little side B's. When you know you're fucked up, you, you got to press B again. <laughs> yeah, there's, oh, already, yeah. there's already some things I can see in the overlay like, that I want to change. <laughs> um, just like I want to move the names out a little bit more. It's a little oh, too close. Yeah, yeah. It's a little too I, close I see to, what you mean, to yeah. the icon, but it's okay. I'll fix that later. But it's like particularly with names like Musket, where it's like real the short T, with yeah. funny sun. It's like eh. yeah, yeah. Anyway. Oh no. Oh no. Funny sun gets the quick stock of misled trash. Stock of champions. The Musket tech and play shine, so you know. He baited the thing and then didn't punish it. That's like the classic first year melee, right? <laughs> you're like, you're like, yeah, I, I did the thing. I read the guy. I made him do the option, and then it's like, 
but he just got up and hit me, so. Ha! Wrong! <laughs> <laughs> That's what it's like. It's, like, yeah, <laughs> it's just like, uh, get good scrub. Yeah, basically. <laughs> hit this time and oh, get the fuck out of my game. Anyway, yeah, Musk is running away from this. Yeah, a little bit. It, or with this, rather. <laughs> um, yeah, right. just kind of running it, running a train on him. Like his punish game hasn't looked that good. It's just like yeah. he, he's kind of just forced situations where he knows he's going to win. And I hate it when the tip of Nair hits like that because it's just like, why does it do that much? Uh, yeah. But that's going to it's gonna be clean up crew for Muscat as he goes one game up. Yep. I'm going to quickly adjust that camera. Yeah, go for it. It'll hit the buttons if necessary. Dude, I just realized, with this setup, you can like definitely just watch yourself with the delay. Oh, yeah. It, it rules, It's dude. just like you hit that up smash, and you turn, you're like, yeah, bitch. <laughs> Got him. Got him. Got him. All right. Good up tilt. Doesn't get any for it, though. So is he swapped to Fox, or is this just a I got no project clear. where he's like, you know, I'm going to try Fox. I'm trying to get into that dice. I need this. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> you know how it is? That, I don't think Dice is accepting any more moves. <laughs> yeah, they're definitely not. Uh, applications are closed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh no, that crab was so nasty. It went nowhere from that back air. Like, holy crab. It was either the like, filthiest... <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> you can't be charging like that. Nah. Or nothing the classic. Oh, yeah, baby. Come on. Oh, come on. You gotta grab the ledge there. Alright. He up tilted. Must get Ned off stage. Oh. Bailey's trying to do something, but it's, it, he's yeah. not getting anything going. It's just like, he, he's got the right ideas. Like, oh, he's off stage. I gotta shine him. But he's not setting up the shine yeah, exactly. at all. People um, forget that you're in midst of 29 frames going down as well as ledge dashing. No wall jump either. The boys. <laughs> Come on, man. That was very, very big to go for that, and it didn't pay off at all. That's ah, alright. He's still in this. Ah, I like the drill from the ledge, but somehow Musket just shined through. Uh, that should be the stuff. Uh, oh, he didn't jump because he was sucking shine. Ending uh, lag. Alrighty. Yeah. Um, so maybe clean that one up for next time. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Oh, up, up smash, bro. <laughs> Oh, they oh must get <laughs> missed the ledge dash onto Randall and just go yeah, like, yeah. We take those. Oh, oh that backer was so good. All right, Musket doesn't go all the way out for it though. Yeah. He definitely could have just made that stop like his, but yeah, he's like, eh, it's yeah, it's like, yeah. I'm gonna get, that. I'm gonna clean it up. It's fine. <laughs> oh, he should have done <laughs> down moon throw. Moonwalk, He should have done, done down throw. It would have been sick. Tech yeah. Oh, at that percent in port one? Nah, -uh. nah, <laughs> nah. -uh. That's a port four privilege. Oh, okay. Need Good that, aerial drift to cover the frame. both of those. Yeah. Good aerial oh. drift to cover both of those, but that's going to do it. What do we got next? Who do we have next? I, I, I got no idea. Oh, <laughs> we got to open one of them tabs. Yeah, but yeah, you're right. Uh, I can actually just open it up on um, on here. Oh, sick. Because my computer is a lot better now. It, it Yeah, it lo does look like a computer. <laughs> you upgrade anything recently? or? Yeah, well... Like, my motherboard fucked up and then on. Oh, well then, yeah. I had to, uh... uh so that's new CPU, new motherboard. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I had to upgrade. It's like, I spent a lot of money on it. It was not fun at uh, all. So um, I guess you, Nick, or... Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. welcome, welcome to the 11 man tournaments, dude. You get a buy into Nick. Yeah. No, I, into I, Captain, I, into I mean, Nick, yeah, just to, keep this, just to keep the ball rolling, me and Nick yeah. will play, I guess. All right. right. BLB. Yep. Oh. Uh, you need me to go get another commentator, or you can uh, grab one while you're over there? Uh, yeah, we'll see what's going on. Yep. All right. I don't know, man. <laughs> you're asking questions like, where's my phone when it's in your pocket? You should be Mr. Freeze, too. Yeah, we can we can do best of fives. Best of five, best yeah. Of five. Yeah. 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 yeah, it's 
like, like top, top six. Come on, man. What are you, Toph? Top five? Yeah. All right, so... Nick... Nick versus Kai, this will be interesting. Docker Red versus Blue Storm Black Mark. Alrighty, that should be good. I'm gonna go try to get another comp at it real quick. Yeah, Sometimes I forget you can get alternate music in melee. What a fucking game. So this is uh, I wasn't that um, wasn't that impressed with my play. Uh, that said, I was, no, there was a lot was. of there was a lot yeah. of like very because I hadn't I haven't played like since getting to the venue and oh okay yeah yeah so uh, it was one of those we just like, keep flubbing until something works. Actual TO joints. Yeah, it's rough. Gonna play Devon next. Hey, you wait till you TO a real tournament. I know. Start losing to PCG and it's all over. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Kai did all the things and then SD. So no, no, none of those wave shines were safe, but people get spooked, so. Yeah. yeah. It's like they could be safe. They could, yeah. Well, it's like. They could be doing sign it safe, so... And by the time you realize it, oh, they wave dash? They, they've already done, like, two and a half shines. Yeah. Uh, it's like, oh, okay, yeah. It looked like it was going to hit his jab. Interesting. I'm surprised he went for wave dash out of shield there. Mm. Oh. <laughs> this is... Uh, uh, this is... That quick 0 to 70 combo that... Like, I got Nick. Is it's rough, you know. Yeah. You, you start out so strong, and then you SD, and then then you get all of a sudden they just you're thirty-one down. Going, how did I get the last stock? Where did it all go wrong? Yeah. Start thinking. Thank God we made that slap dash decision to make the best five. Yeah, you know, we have, we have time. We have time. Um, I think Kai's in the same boat as you. He hasn't played any games today, other than yeah, it's, 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 it's rough. Yeah. You play people who've been warming up, you know? Davin and Nick have been playing since probably before I got here, before probably around when Kai got here, so. Uh, you know, I haven't been playing that long, you but, just, you know. Well, I mean, I only got here like quarter two, so. Oh, quarter okay, five, yeah. so. Hey. Um, oh, I know what's going on here. Ah, uh, yeah, the classic. The Dreamland counter pick into Jigglypuff switch. Um, Yep. Nick definitely the best buff in uh, Australia. I mean, assuming Spud doesn't have one, yeah. That's true, yeah. yeah. Which, like, I don't think he does. And there's a lot of, like... Too busy little, working on the game. There's, like, a lot of also, like... Little stuff, like, little um, technical bits of buff that... It's not like going from a space to another space. Yeah, thing, exactly. You know? There's, it's like, lots of little You have to put a little bit of timing in there. It's not just back airing. It's not just spaced back airs. You know? Yeah, there's tech chase rest. I mean... That's, that's like... Uh, you, once you hit forward at edge guards, that's like 97% of the game plan. I think it's like, actually, the actual effort that goes into, like, gimping. Or just, like, edge guarding box. It's actually, like... Like, you know, like, it is and it isn't. It's like, in certain spots, it's super free. And in other spots, it's like, how the fuck do, do you hit this edge guard? I think it's this, like, because there's so many little different timing mix ups at the box, and like just moving mix ups to the box and doing Puff goes so high from down throw, what the fuck? Never knew that. 
So right now he's not in any huge ding. <laughs> okay, well, if he, if he runs off. But the moment he gets to like 14% when, you know, up for a rest is... Oh, that, that was uh, good. I do love that sound, though. When you, like, spike him into the ground and it makes the, like, death sound, it's like, something's got to kill soon. Yeah. This is always a danger. Yeah. Yeah. And you Falco, so you don't even get that much off it. And it's a real feels bad. I mean, unless they hold full DI in, and then you can kill them. I wonder if there's any real benefit to full hop drill, ledge cancel, drill again. Uh, yeah, it's... Yeah. It's those sorts of spots where edge guarding is buff. It's just kind of like, oh yeah, they just die. Oh yeah, I mean... It's like, if that, you clip someone with fair by the ledge, it's just like, well, they're going down. That was Fair cool. again, it's like, kind of over. So that was like a, a slight panic side B. Went a bit too high yeah. for... Um, and P Puff's so good at covering that sort of stuff. Yeah. It's, it's not hard for her to cover, like, actual sweet spot side B. Yeah, but sweet spot light side B. You're spacey like, sometimes. Yeah. You know, you just like, I just gotta make, I gotta get back to center. I gotta get, just get back to stage. I'm in danger. I can't, I can't risk the, um, the fast full side B. What if I die? Yeah, good down smash. Surprise that hit. Cover the air dodge. Yeah. It's always what people mess up that coverage. Well, yeah, usually the puff drifts out a little bit more on the edge dodge, so they can, like, weave around and get back around the, like, down smash. So I'm not going to lie, it's looking pretty over. I mean... It's looking pretty over. <laughs> like... Like, I can't see a situation in which Kai wins neutral 20 times in a row and just wins this game. Yeah, saying if it's Yoshi's, there's always that, well... Yeah, he could just get a shine off the top at, like, 30, and, like, you know, it's an even game. Because, you know, they're both one hit to death. <laughs> the sad part of it is the right. If the percents and stocks are reversed, you're like, I still has a chance, you know? Yeah. You get like a decent, um, decent, say, something set up to a edge yeah, guard yeah, into yeah. like up for a rest. And even but. if the rest doesn't kill, they spend all their time coming back. Yeah, I kind of did that, and that's gonna do it. Yeah. Yep. All right. I yeah. think we're going back to Dreamland for the. Um, I'm not sure. Or do you think we're just gonna go to something like Battlefield? Where would you take him? Yoshi's? Yoshi's? Okay, yeah. Yeah. that's yeah. true. Yeah, that's it's it's not like it's a um, bad stage for Falco in this matchup. It's one of the better stages for Falco, okay. and it's which I guess in hindsight, if he'd rather play the um, Marf on Yoshi's than the Puff on Dreamline, then. This might be his new first counter pick in the future, but what do you mean, like? If he'd rather play this matchup against Marth on Yoshi's than Marth on Dreamline, then in the future, next time he, next time they play, so we just pick this first, yeah. Probably. Yeah. Well, it might also be a, like I'm too old down. I'm getting kind of beaten up. I'll just pick the high variant stage. It might be, but he, he might have been thinking, you know, maybe Battlefield's better, maybe Stadium's better. Yeah. It's been a while yeah. since I've actually seen anyone do that. Like, uh, sh shine, shine to, to like, yep. wait for Randall. Like, he did the right thing, and it was just like, the right thing is way too obvious. I mean, this is only option, though. Yeah. <laughs> it was one of those, if, like... If he was slightly higher, he could have gone... Oh. Uh, yeah, if he was slightly higher, he could have gone for the, like, um, side B. But not at that height. Oh. You know, I empathize. You know, you haven't moved up. Yeah. You, you've got to play Marth. I mean, don't get me wrong, Nick is obviously the better player yeah. by a pretty big margin, so it's not like... But when are you going to play, like, you know, what's probably a 70-30 matchup or something? Damn. <laughs> I mean, Falco's worse than Fox, it uh, makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Alright, that's try. probably the best shot I've ever seen in my life. He dodged both jabs. Mm. Yeah, this is looking oh, yeah, this down to this. Yeah. Could have been that. That's that sort of, like, shield that fucking demoralizes you. I think you're getting a free, like, punish, and all of a sudden, oh, it's all I'm over. Gonna play Devin. Yeah, good luck.
clear all that. Yep. Musket, musket. Actually, let's do that while I'm here. It's good on man. The, some of the worst melee ever played in South Australia. Yeah, it's not been a good <laughs> day for melee so far. De it definitely feels like like if the last set goes anything. Oh, I should have hit that one. Um, if this set goes like the last set, the warm up player will definitely win. Yeah. Yeah. Kai, uh, I don't know. Probably I think the worst he's ever played. Yeah, it was definitely I don't like. I think he's happy about it. Yeah, it's definitely one of those. He didn't get any warm up. He didn't like. Yeah. He didn't prepare for any of it. He just kind of like rocked up and got bodied. And was like, yep. Marth will do that. Yeah. How was the jet? Fantastic. So who do you think's got this one? I think... Mm, Davin has got it. All right. Why, who do you think has got this one? I don't know. I can't remember who won the last one between them. I think it was Musket, but... Like, I think they've gone back and forth in the last couple of years. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Musket won first Cheese League, but... Yeah, cause, yeah. But I don't know if he won, like, Evac or some shit. I don't know. Right. So I was like, I think Musket won the last one, but I think Devin's the favorite. How many entrants do we have today? Like, 11. Yeah, you gotta oh, start coming a room on full of people. You gotta start coming on Sundays, man. Can't do Sundays. Them's the brakes. They are the brakes. They really are the brakes. Yeah. Oh, they did the thing. No. Alright. Up throw getting it is an interesting fox combo. It's really hard to up throw combo so you could low percent. It's kind of yeah. like a mix up. The safe thing to do is up tilt, but they can jump out of it. So if you try to do an aerial, they can yeah. Can't you do that at zero with the lower port? Or the higher port, or whatever it is? Like, he's yeah. got the good grab it's one. It's still like frame perfect. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, good SDI. I think depending on where they DI as well, like sometimes you can get like a nail. Yeah, 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 that's true. All the stuff. But. Devon's been SDIing up. Looks good. He gets he out of it. shit. Yeah. But also it makes him jump in really dumb places. Uh, for the characters in. Yeah. What am I doing? He was like trying to SD up. That's my moth on FD. Oh, yeah. That he was, had no double jump. And I just kept yeah. up tilting him and waiting for like three seconds. So yeah. Like, this SDI up is doing literally nothing. Like, I'm not comboing you. Yeah, it's just like... <laughs> Like trying to go for the timeout in the most yeah. subtle way <laughs> possible. Yeah. Has the musket peach ever made its way back? I I think he wants to use it a little bit more, but I don't know if he's actually. Ooh. Get red. Yeah, I don't. I don't think he's like been actively practicing it as such, but I think that's the sort of thing. Like, come bam, he'll probably. Get it ready just in case. I was talking to the, the Krishkowski brothers who sure. came from Canada. You remember them? Oh, yeah, yeah. And they were saying that his peach is definitely a lot better than his fox. Yeah, I could say that. But that said, they probably have a lot more spacey experience. Yeah. Like they play like, against each other for one. Yeah, and it's like Canada doesn't really have that many floaties anymore. They used to back in the day, but V like, wins. Yeah, they like, still exist. Exactly. I'm like, I don't know if he still exists. I don't know if Kobe Kaze still exists. Like, do they have any floaties at all? It's a mystery. Anyone in chat, let us know. Yeah. What are those players? State of exist? Canada's floaties. Drop up there, that's a interesting one. Oh yeah. Ooh. Is this Ned? Yeah. Like said, the Ned's real good. 
Yeah. You're going to add a throw or you get hit. Like shine well, you can kind of like shine yeah. and wait, wait it out. Well, I don't know if you could have in that like spot. I feel like sometimes it just hits. Nah, you can drop further. Probably, yeah. Like if you fast forward well, yeah, you can get around it. One of the best reactions from Musket in those situations. Alright. I don't know who I want to play out of these two. I played a lot more against Devox today, so I know what to expect. And I'm warmed up in the matchup. But Musket does play a Fox. Yeah. We can definitely up throw a Fox. Just kind of have to yeah. play with him for a little bit. I don't know bit. If, if I remember how to do that anymore, though. I, I mean, haven't played for a while. It's a best of five. You'll probably figure it out. Hopefully. Davin goes deep, like a yeah. Korean DJ. What yeah. ethnicity is uh, Dav DevOps? Uh, Vietnamese, if his dad's yeah. restaurant is to say anything. What What is it called? Danny's? I thought it was... Uh, Thai, I mean. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. damn right. Well, why, why did I get Vietnamese from? What the fuck? Is He's he Thai? He, I think he is Thai, yeah. Interesting. I'll ask him after this game. I'm pretty <laughs> sure he's Thai. Anyone in the chat knows what nationality uh, Davin is? Because I feel like he comes from a family of entrepreneurs, and... Maybe that they, they don't care as much about what ethnicity they are and authenticity kind of thing as they do about profit margins and yeah. uh, filling a gap in the market, you know? Yeah, but then that begs the question, why Thai? People love Thai. Yeah, but there's like a Thai place across the road from that Thai place. And it's just like, yeah, well, this that, is better. I bet so. Danny's was there first. I mean, maybe. The other one looks like hella old. Yeah, well. it's, it might be one of those things where they're like, People would eat at that Thai restaurant if it was good. We should maybe, just do that. Maybe Davin's um, family owns the crappy run-down Thai restaurant as well and makes oh. it look as run-down <laughs> as possible. And just like has people in there been like, man, I hear that Thai over the street is way better than this. <laughs> yeah. It's, a, it's one way to run a business. Yeah, it's called like Jeff's greasy Thai buckets of slum. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff's fantastic. He knows a lot of uh, stuff. I've never heard that name, and I never will again. Oh yeah, particularly if Wobbling gets banned. Why? His legend, Ices. Oh uh, yeah. I think it says that. Yeah. I uh, what's the relevance of that? Ices on floaty. They're midway. SMH yet, midweight. That, that is a big down smash too. Huge one. Yeah. Breakdance on him. Yep. Uh, Erica Mustard's game plan is do the exact same thing. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I'm sure he has some subtle adaptations in mind. I think about Mustard is he's very cerebral and I often don't notice the adaptations he's making. Yeah. And often it's so that. cerebral that they don't actually impact the game state. Yeah, that's unfortunate <laughs> when it happens, but... <laughs> yeah. Oh, huge. But he looks like he's made some, uh, some big changes. Some adjustments. Oh. And Davin dropping that tech chase, or Davin chase, as we call it here in South Australia. But he's getting a combo. Or yeah. uh, Davin... Oh, why did he go for the back air? Oh, oh, it yeah? doesn't matter. Huge. You can do any move with it in your cheek. Yeah. It's like Falcon. You just like throw an arrow out and it'll probably combo. It's the original Falcon. Before Falcon had that reputation, Sheik had that reputation. Yeah. I was talking to Davin earlier about how he has no skill and relies completely on luck. And that combo just proved my point. <laughs> Is it luck? Like, you gotta pick the right character on the character select screen. It's like the skill in that. That's true. I'm like learning that by playing playing Smash Ultimate. It's like, there's no point in playing a bad character. <laughs> like, you'll learn sooner or later that you suck. Yeah. Dude, you know what I don't get about Ultimate? Why is Olimar good? Like, what is good about him? I try to play Olimar and nothing good happens. I mean, like, it's just Brawl, but worse, so it's like he's decent. His moves don't seem good and he doesn't have any combos. I don't get. Does he have combos? 
Like, he has some, but it's more like they kind of kicks you out and, like, annoys the other guy until they lose. Right. I just don't get it. Yeah. You know who I do understand is why they're good. Rob. That's the character yeah. that makes sense. Ro Rob definitely just, like, does some stuff, and then you get, like, down thrown or side beat and you die. Yeah. He's got a big up like, there. He's got big moves. He's got yeah. a big neutral there. He definitely has a big neutral there. You just spam that one move and win. And occasionally yep. throw projectiles. Olimar has it, has it tough, is all I'm saying. I don't know, it doesn't look that way watching like top eights of mages. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand. Maybe that's the difference between me and the pros. Maybe, better yeah. at ultimate than I am. Well, that's probably the case. You know, I wouldn't count you out. No, I mean, anything's possible. That's what my Whoa. old soccer coach used to tell me. I think I've told this story on stream a lot. Uh, must be about to lose. That's not what my coach told me. Devin uh, I mean, that would have been quite the read from the soccer coach. <laughs> Devin <laughs> beat Musket, yeah. <laughs> yeah just... Am I, are we playing Winners Finals or uh, some I other shit? I think we're doing some other shit. <sighs> Probably. And the problem is Musket's TOing, so... Anyway, my, my coach used to tell me, uh, us, our team, because we weren't very good. We were in the first division of whatever under-14s club sides were, but we were like, we scraped in. And we only oh, yeah. were in there because uh, the first team at my club was like quite good. Oh, okay, yeah, it was one of those sorts of deals. I mean, it's not really, but I think it's a lot of politics and, uh, you know, yeah, yeah. a lot of high-ranking Italian soccer people had a lot of things to say. Anyway, the point is, my coach, when we would yeah. be facing a team that was better than us, which is almost every week, would say, you boys, you're going to win this. You know why? Because these guys, they're not so great. they got the same legs, they got the same number of arms. <laughs> Yeah, same head, same balls. You always say that. Everyone <laughs> would always laugh. Hey, he's a, yeah, he's a soccer coach. That makes sense. Same balls. And so you're going to, you know, there's no reason they should be yeah. beating you. And, and then you go out there and you get whooped. That's how I feel about me and Smash Ultimate. I have the same amount of limbs. Yeah. Testicles. Visual yeah. capacity mo for the most part. Ooh. You're getting fucking sibling rivalry. Oh shit! I hope I hope Musket and Catherine. I don't know what I'm saying. I hope yeah. Catherine wins, obviously. Because that would be much funnier. <laughs> Wouldn't be funny. It would just be. It'd be good to see. Well, yeah, it'd be it'd be a lot of things. That's what's so great about Catherine it. Catherine has lived in Musket's shadow for years. She, yeah. she was born probably. Does Musket's she get the Musket tag born. if she wins this? I hope so. Uh, Andrew and Anthony, Anthony, Anthony. Anthony. Yeah, that's, that's just yeah. weird. Peach. Daisy, I guess. Daisy is so dope. Yeah. I'm glad Daisy is in Ultimate. It's probably like... And I'm glad she's top tier. Yeah. I think the thing I find so funny about it is... Like, if you ever, like... Every game, you look at Peach's costumes and you go, Shit. 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 Daisy. Yeah. And then you look at Daisy's in Ultimate and they look good. It's like, yeah, how did this happen? Daisy's a beautiful <laughs> lady. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Daisy can just wear anything if she looks good. Yeah, probably. That's why she's wearing yellow here. To make it fair for Peach. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have loved, like, Smash Ultimate Peach mains going 0-2 down and switching to Daisy. And then Ghost doing the same thing, reverse. With yeah, and winning? Switching to Peach and winning, yeah. Uh, so Ghost plays Daisy usually? Yeah. Yeah, that's, I don't like that. I don't like switching off Daisy. Uh, yeah. Best five. Oh, it's best five. Yeah, I know. I know. Ready, It'll just make the upset more impressive. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Catherine was playing pretty good earlier. Against my Falcon and Devox's Fox. Oh, that's good. She definitely is 1-0 up against Davin's Fox. Yeah, she beat him in tournament. Yeah. And we all benefited that day, except for Devon, who went 0-2. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about Musket's haircut? I mean, it's a haircut. That's true. It's like, that's all I really It's a have men's to say haircut. If you yeah. went into a barber shop and you said, please, you, may you I have one men's haircut? Yeah, you, you get that. And you just picked a random number between one and three. I don't know which one that actually is. And yeah. you, get, you get that. 
And you definitely good. pay like a third of the price of a women's haircut. Yeah. Oof. Check your privilege, Musket. I wonder how... Do you think Musket has to get his haircut more often than Catherine? Probably not three times as often. Probably not that much more often, but you know. You know you, I like Catherine's murder face. Yeah. I think that's important. Like, yeah. just in case your opponent looks at you and you, like, stone cold eyes. Look at that. Oh, she's, she's evil. Yeah. <laughs> oh my. She looks like some kind of uh, anime cartoon villain, you know? Not that yeah, I would yeah. know, but I'm sure Catherine <laughs> would know. I love the way her eyes, like, looked up as she was throwing the turnips up. Like, yeah. checking them for the stitches. You gotta, yeah, I mean, you gotta use your eyes in this game. You, you definitely do. Eyes and hands. Those are the important ones. And ears. They're less important, but Smell, still pretty important. not so much. You don't want to be using that too much. Yeah, that, 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 <laughs> that'll, that'll slow you down, if anything. <laughs> exactly. You'll definitely be making angry tweets after the tournament. Yeah. And the thing is, if you have a diminished sense of smell, your other senses are more... Heightened, yeah. Yeah, heightened. Be having it's a like bad a sense of smell is actually such an advantage in the video games. But how many years do you reckon until esports goes so hard that you know people are amputating their legs to like up their upper body? Oh, give it a few years at least. Like, like yeah. I think that's a twenty-year plan. But you know, do you remember that once upon a time that Twitch streamer who's in a wheelchair, who's like a Diablo Twitch streamer, and then he like stood up one day by accident <laughs> and got banned. I mean, yeah, you would. <laughs> it's like you can't be doing that. Yeah. Just grab the ledge. I don't understand why Peaches float I hate it. towards like the ledge, not facing backwards. Yeah, his back is just as good. I mean, it's like you know, it, it's gonna cover what Nair's gonna cover. And but then the you down get air hitbox is pretty nice when you're facing forwards. I guess is the thing. Yeah, but if you're going for down air, can't you just grab ledge and kill him? Yeah, you're right. You're 100 percent right, Jack. Yeah. It's just a lack of confidence. Yeah, probably. Get him. Yeah. Oh, bad. yeah. She should have gone down there, Armada style. Yo, I'm going to miss Peaches going down there. It's going to be like a solid six months where people don't do it. Yeah, the last going down there, Peach, is, is gone, unfortunately. Well, the only one. Yeah. Yeah, the last. <laughs> the last. I'm sure there have been other going down there features, but who even plays Beast at the moment? Triff? Triff, yeah. Uh, Lord Wood if he showed up to things. Kalamazoo. Yeah. I see him destroying Mango from time to time. Yeah. On Mango's stream. Oh, snipe, take the ledge. Just back here. Back here. Back here's better. I, but, mean, uh, I don't care. Back, if, you oh. know, if you know the other guy's just gonna like keep protecting and side being, down smash might be better. <laughs> no, back is still better. <laughs> Back here, you can just land it back there again. Well, yeah, if they're not like doing, if they're not getting out of the down smashes though, it does more damage. I mean, if the other player is bad, it's it's better. I don't even think it is better. I think it's just the same. But yeah, probably. More middle. Yeah, probably. But you know, must get hit by it. So. Also, must get hit by it, and he got hit all the way to the other side of the stage. Yeah. Could have lived if he was like one percent lower. Makes yeah. you think. You gotta optimize in this game, Catherine. Yeah. You definitely do. Can't just do whatever and hope it works. Well, that was a really good reverse there. I wish yeah. he had like known he was gonna go for ledge with side B. Because all I was thinking is, this is where you down smash. Oh, like, yeah. make that That's why they don't take the ledge. Yeah. They're scared of that happening. Well, like that's why you react. Uh, it's harder on found, I guess. But. I like that down smash. Down smash when you're late on the tech chase? Pretty good. Yeah. It's definitely like Peach's Thanks. fastest yeah. decent option. Must be definitely could have. It's, it's fast, but it also covers spot dodge. Yeah. It covers a bunch of stuff. It covers roll through. Yeah, that is true. It definitely covers a lot more than like the standard, like, well, I'm just going to shine and hope. And if they shield, it just like chips away at the shield. People are bad at punishing it. I mean, it's probably not as good as like spamming plug cancel nares or something, but 
Yeah. Waiting for the day we get that peach where they just like they hit a shield and they just break it. I mean, you can't. Like, like I know you can't, but like you know what I mean. Like, at the very least, freak people out until they get hit by a net. Yeah. Like the same way that like West Ball shines people. You can always roll out of it. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, probably. Like repeated nets you can roll out of. I'm pretty sure nair to jab. If you do it perfectly, you can't roll out of. But well, like, you don't get anything up to jab. Yeah. yeah. You might even be able to catch roll with Nair to uh, down smash, actually. Yeah, probably. Pretty sure you can. Because roll takes four frames to start. Oh my, Nair. Should have done like a float Nair and then adjust to where she was. Yeah, down smash the whole platform afterwards. She only covered, she didn't cover, she only covered one option, right? Like she yeah. could have covered any two. She tried to recatch the turn when she just did like dash back or something. Oh, and he misses the ledge. Ooh, must get looking like Zai right now. Yeah. And dropping a game to Catherine. I, I, I shouldn't say that. Catherine taking game two. Yeah. Yeah. All right, stadium. Do you think this is the right pick? It seems about right. I think it's the right pick. I don't, yeah. can't think of a better stage. Yeah. It's like this or Yoshi's and like. Size helps him, so yeah, it's the right pick. Yeah. This is much better for Musket. Uh, uh, you gotta at least try to SDI or something. I'm sure she tried. Yeah. I feel like up, up throw up there should never work on Peach. When I see Armada play anyone, it, it just looks it like it never it's, ever works. Yeah. It's not even just because of SDI, it's like he DIs it and then it's like they don't even reach it. Yeah. Oh, that was bullshit. That's unfair. I should be banned. Remember that Grim Tuesday post about how wobbling is like comparable to Moth's F Smash? I mean. <laughs> I, I mean, it, what do you if mean, there Jack? was a version of the game where you like always held out, then maybe. Like, if you always had terrible DI, then Martha F Smash would be pretty close and always tip it. Then it would be. I mean, if there was a version of the game where there was no DI, then wobbling wouldn't be as bad. Because the whole problem with wobbling yeah. is, like, every everything would be a wobble, right? Yeah, exactly. Then, then it's like, oh, hold this fucking Falcon up air combo where you literally don't have a chance. And you always get needed at the end. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. If everything was DI out, could you get guaranteed zero deaths on everyone? Uh, probably not. I reckon you could, because you can just end every combo really early. Yeah, I guess. You get up air to up air to up air with Moth to like air smash and they'd always die. Yeah, yeah. That was a quick game. It was. We're over here debating if Moth F smash is wobbling. It's arguably better than wobbling. It has more utility, I'll give it that. Probably is better than wobbling. Although, if you do an F Moth F smash on shield, it's punishable. But if you if you oh, wobble on shield, wobble it's on not shield punishable. Is, <laughs> wobble on shield is real good. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Catherine just in no man's land though with that edge guard, not covering the platform or the ledge. You gotta cover something. Yeah. How did that not hit? Because of the lip. A little lip, yeah, maybe. He snuck underneath the back air. Oh, this is bullshit. <laughs> that was, uh, that was yeah. unfair. How did he fold the ledge like that? So weird. Oh, well, it was a crazy game. Was it like a tech back? Yeah, it was a tech back. Yeah, you can do that. You if just you hold away, or? It's like either when you're on your front or on your back and you do the, like, um, miss tech roll backwards kind of thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. You just end up on the ledge. That's weird. There was an SSBM tutorial about it, I'm pretty sure, in, like, 2014. Probably. I probably just forgot about it. Yeah. So I remember watching them all. My favorite one of those is still if you, like, Stand up from ledge is chic and throw all needles, you go back to ledge, but if you yeah, throw five, like you don't. That. And it's only if they shield it as well. If you hit, hit them with it, it doesn't happen. Catherine with a really bad 
attempt. She should have just down aired. She just instantly started float down airing when she knocked the pops off. Yeah. That's the only thing she could have like done to cover anything. And I would have killed. I mean, assuming all the other parts work out. Oof. That up tilt hit that would have been the end of a very quick game. What a grab. What a deck out grab. Oh, the exact stuck happened yeah. in stuck one. It looked like it, it looked, that at least looked like she was trying to cover it and just fell too quickly. Yeah. Like had that peach, I'm going to float cancel the fair. Of course I'm going to float cancel it. When it's like, no, nah, you just fair and kill the guy. Yep. Don't need to cancel to kill the guy. All right, so I imagine the other side of losers is being played by now. So it'll be Kai, Funny Son, or Kai versus... I wonder what the Vortex Elf? for, like, Peach covering different options is there. I think she could probably just cover, like, stay on stage, do, like, a back air to cover the low but not ledge angle, and then just jump an up air or something to cover a high angle. Maybe. Because you can't cover the ledge and the platform, but you can probably cover what she was covering and I feel like you might be able to, with Peach, do some, like, if you're on the platform already, she'll drop, like, to cover ledge and then float at the right height. Like, Maybe. if you, depending on, like, how far the fox is away. But it's probably real difficult, and it's probably safer to just, like, co like look to cover ledge, and if they don't go ledge, just jump and do something. Jump and press A. Yeah. It'll be interesting to see whether Kai can pull it together. Yeah. I was not impressed by his performance against me. I thought it was lackluster. Yeah. It was pretty bad. Uh, Some of the... Oh, Terry, he, he just died repeatedly. Yeah, like there was I a few... I didn't even do anything. Yeah, you didn't do shit. <laughs> he just it got was just like... <laughs> <laughs> it was just like, ah, oh. <laughs> all right. The, it was just like the Witch King versus Round 1 pools edge guards where he just like got down through a runoff there and it was just like, oh, you jumped in. Nice. Yeah. My favorite one was when Kai took like 10 seconds on the platform, ran down, instantly got down through, down to the uh, runoff up beard. Yeah. He just like <laughs> sat, sat there on the platform 10 seconds, instantly like... died, sat there again for 10 seconds. I'll right. pass that on to Kai. T. Kano. Uh, Fox. Blue. Sounds right. Wait, are they playing already? No, nah, they're him already. Sure. No, I think they're playing. Well, they're fucking playing. How is this are happening? They? They're totally playing. Look at this. Look at this. We got a real match. I saw I saw um, Bailey give the FTC nod when he died. Uh, the, does that mean he's improving? Probably. No, it just means they're playing. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why Bailey's playing Fox. I don't know. Like, Falco so is already arguably better than McLeod, so, I mean, how. Obviously, he's got potential with it. Yeah. Oh. Look, mate, Kai is not the devil, alright? That's a good up B that no one does. The down towards yeah, the ground just one. And just aim see. at the guy. Yeah. It's super good against Moth, because if he down tilts, you just hit him in the head. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, I can do that. And everyone's afraid of going near the Moth, so just don't do it. Looks like Kai's somewhat warm. I get the oh, no. feeling he might have been playing a few games against Davin or something off stream. Just like, oh my. Go real quick, warm me up, sort of thing. That was a good run shine from Kai to start that whole. I don't know, stuff happened. He could have weak back out there, but he tried to shine or something. That's good. Yeah. It, shine was interesting. It looked like he was trying to save him, but I know he was just doing it to turn around. Yeah. One thing Kai is doing well today is running up and shining. That's the only thing that was good about him in now set. He ran up and shined me a couple of times. That was good. Uh, yeah, this one's looking pretty done. And I uh, sure do love the best of fives. <laughs> <laughs> maybe Bailey will win. Uh, maybe. I mean, Catherine took this game off musket, so we'll see. What do you think about uh, Bailey using the funny sun tag, TK now? I think it's disrespectful. I think it's extremely respectful. Yeah, I don't know what to think about it. 
If I ever All retire. I think about it is we should really be taking bets on who gets a real tag first, Samus guy or him. Is that his Twitter, Lord TF? I think it is, yeah. Explain. What an upset. I don't know. Hey, that ain't Fox. Over the rainbow, am I right? Uh, happy feet. <laughs> <laughs> Other 2008 commentary. Yeah. Kai definitely wants the 30% of the $45. Yeah, well, he probably wants 60% of it. Well, no, I think the joke there was it was like Zoo versus Science Spectre, and they knew they were going to lose to Mango. Uh. No, wait. In the Wombo Gumba. No, 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 like in whichever set they said that shit. Ah. Uh. Because that all happened in like a month or two. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. The, the, the homemade like, waffle 7-7 seven, seven or whatever. Yeah, yeah. YouTube channel. I kind of miss the old YouTube channels. Like, they were crap, but like... Oh, you should have run off and dead. Oh, wait, no, he's... He's, he's, he's stuck a, left. Yeah. <laughs> I thought he was on last stuck. You know what I miss more than... some things? Smash Bros. Smash Bros. is so good. Yeah. Learning a character now is not the same. Back in the yeah, day, you exactly. just go to a character guide, you like... Have arguments about why forward air yeah, is better yeah. than down tilt or something. Exactly. It's like <laughs> nowadays it's like, oh you gotta find the Discord and then you end up on the fucking Smash 4 Discord somehow. Ugh. Looking for chic information. It's just like, how did this come up and why is it like He's just uh, reading through like a thread from two thousand and five with like some guy two guys with like fire emblem display pictures talking yeah. about how like whether Moth's forward air is faster than Sheik's forward air and none of them know because frame dot didn't happen yet. So yeah, Mitch King <laughs> kept that shit to himself for a little while. So I just compiled it. But yeah. I'm surprised he hasn't tried anything other than Fox today. Like, probably trying to save face. Probably, probably scared that it'll get exposed if he plays himself here. I don't get it. You don't get to have a secondary tournament when you haven't done anything with your man. Yeah, like... I mean, it has been McLeod. <laughs> I mean, that's... I take that back. <laughs> that was Falco, or...? Falco Luigi, I'm pretty sure. Okay, yeah. That's not bad. That's a tough matchup for Luigi if his punish game isn't that good. Yeah, if you don't get 90 off, like, every random nair you hit, you're in a bit of trouble. Remember that set with uh, that Washington Falco and, and uh, Luigi kid, I think? It was like SK92 versus uh, oh, Luigi yeah, yeah, yeah. He shoots him to like 200%. Yeah, he just lasered him the entire set. <laughs> I mean, you're not going to hit the power shield. That's going to happen. It's the closest thing I've ever seen to watching Splice play in America. <laughs> There's like more, more Splice than Zangazin. More Splice than Splice. Yeah. I mean, Spice now is not like that, but back in the day, he used to do a lot of that. Yeah. Definitely the brawl side of him, where he was just like, this is this is the thing, I'm going to do it until the other guy loses. Yeah, he was like, I'm not losing anything in this position, so... I'm just going to keep doing it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, come on, dude. People are bad at covering that. Oh! He tricked him. He got the first him. good thing he's done this set. Probably just missed an upwards angle. I mean, he might have, but, you know. That's the thing about Melee. It's a game about embracing chaos and uh, making the most of your mistakes. Because God knows they're going to happen. Exactly. It's like in life. Melee is kind of like life. Sometimes it's like life if, like, a whole year was, like, four minutes. You just ride that roller coaster fucking constantly. Yeah. But also on a macro scale, like, the, the journey of Melee is yeah. like life. You start off like a baby, unable to, you know... Walk, speak, eat unassisted. You show up to your game without Jamage yelling at you. And sometimes you don't make it past that stage. But sometimes you do. Sometimes. Yeah. A lot of the infant mortality rate in me melee is pretty high. Yeah. Sometimes you forget that, like, you know, 25% of people go O2. Yeah. Ooh, that was sick. Yeah, get owned, kid. <laughs> All right, I think I gotta play something. Yeah, you gotta play Devon. Hell yeah, heal yeah. And I gotta change this before I forget.
Oh, okay, yeah. I'll get that to musket. Yeah. Oh, what are we doing? Oh, he's going the white moth. Interesting. I feel like Nick's more powerful somehow with the white moth. Oh, no. Except for when he's getting bodied, and then it feel, he feels the need to swap, and it's all over. Got the opposite dark side of the moon thing happening. I don't know who's going to win this one. I know Davin wants a piece of me, purely because he hasn't gotten to play him much while he's been in SA. Like, it's just one of those things where, like, Nick hasn't shown up to the Sunday tournaments, Davin's missed a few Friday tournaments, so, you know, they just kind of get to play. Alright, get away from Nick, and he gets to do the damages. But he fucks up! It's neutral. That was definitely a slap, not a needle. Uh, what do you need in there for, man? Yep, that'll do it. Early lead, Nick. That was a really good slide off, but he jumped straight into another up tilt, so. Yeah, nothing for it. We got to be on 69. That shit's busted. We've all seen the clips. Oh, we should drop up here. Yeah. You'd think with Nick's extensive PAL experience, he'd be able to hit that. But no. Got all those things. Back air. Put there. Oh. You take that trade if you're dabbing, though. You're down that whole stock and you get to just even it out by trading near with up It's also the sort of spot, though, where if you know... You should probably just near and hit L anyway. Just cover all your bases. You know you're going to get a hit by up a lot of the times there. You just What's good, Ruben? Dude, he keeps missing the bloody up -bees. Good play, Trash. Not good enough, at least. But, right. Yeah, that's gonna do it. So, what's up, everyone? Kaiser's back on the mic. How did, how did we get here, Jack? How do we get here? Oh, no! Well, Where like, Davox is about to go, uh, even in stocks against Nick right now. Well, like, he was losing the whole start of the game, and then he ran off Ned and traded stocks, so, you know. I mean, truly the biggest brain of prime plays. Well, he, well, I'm saying he should have hit L and, like, lived. He got the stage spike for the up B. And they both kind of just died nah. in, like, dumbass ways. No slide off, and now Davin's yeah. taking, like, 70% just from yeah. that. Did he got the slide off before and just like immediately jumped into the, like tip up tilt and it was like you, you wasted all that effort hitting the good slide off. The last bit is just like Moth can just get be like super duper greedy and just be like, oh you're gonna do slide if like I read you doing a slide off I get a tip rep smash. Yeah yeah. Which is the scariest thing for well, like it's not so happen. bad as chic, but like again as spaces it's like oh no. Yeah, I suppose. Oh, oh no! Oh. oh no. Yeah, that's the classic. You hold it for the right amount, but you don't adjust for when you get the hit. Yeah, rough. Also, <laughs> when I make the overlay, and then we we move places, I find us in the fixed student lounge. <laughs> you know? Oops. It's okay. Um, so that's 1-0. Yeah. Uh, and we got well, Nick like on the puff. Where do you put now? Because, you know, there's no name on the door. I mean, we just put it downstairs. We, we just go old, old, old uni bar. Like level, just like level five, uh, level five union house or something. Yeah, I think that would be the best course of action. Yeah. Anyway, it's just funny that the room has no name anymore. But anyway, um, Nick on his uh, puff counter pick. 
um, grind later. Yeah. <laughs> to say that least. Uh, basically, like he's always wanted a character. For yeah, yeah, but he, ne he needed a Dreamland character, and it's like he's finally got one, and it's pr it's the, probably the best Dreamland character you could pick, you know? Yeah. Um, but Davin, with the stock lead at the moment, has other thoughts. Yeah, I was wondering how Davin was going to get out of that situation of uh, I'm kind of in disadvantage, kind of not, but Puff can definitely back it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Puff can definitely back it. Uh, I like the F smash idea, but like, not the time for it, I guess. Yeah, it was rough. Davin's running away with this, which means it's even. Oh, that's not where you want to be. Is that's Nick. a dead Puff. Right, by the way. Oh, no. that was oh. so close. He needed to throw needles at him. He did, but he just missed them. Well, he threw them the wrong way. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's where I'm going with this. <laughs> yeah, that's where I'm going with this, James. It's, like, it's, like, it's like there's missing and then there's not aiming at the target. Yeah, tech check rest. Oh, up smash. Oh, that's not going to kill. Yeah. <laughs> that's, okay, like... When that happens, you get rested, and then you don't get to punish, and then suddenly they're ahead. I get salty, man. Yeah. Like, what do you... What? Sheik really has no good rest punishes. Yeah, and, like, what's good in... What's left in the bag, you know? What's left in the bag? That's I all mean, I gotta say. Yeah. Also, unironically... I wonder if up B would have killed. Probably this, not. This mix of being here means that we would only need two more headsets and we have another audio yeah, for you, another stream. You're right. We only need two more headsets. Like, yeah. We could, in theory, just get one crap mic and, like, call it a day. Basically, so, yeah. yeah. Which is what we've been doing the last couple yeah, of yeah. streams. Yeah, yeah. Kind of noticed. Well, it's like, it's a headset, but it's, you know, one man's commentary when there's four people around the desk. It's like, uh, uh. Yeah. Buff gets slapped across stage at 110. It does nothing. All right, is this a KO? Yeah, that's a bit. Yeah, I mean, good setup. Get that NTSC down throw. It's pretty good. Hoo-ha. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, this is rough for Davin. Okay. Oh. Nick tries to go yeah. super deep and like misses his jump or something and doesn't get another backer. I mean, he's still like in the way. Yeah, yeah he definitely it's... like got 100% yeah. in a matchup where, like, unless you get rest, you don't really get long strings. Yeah, true that. But it's like, why does Puff get to just crouch under shit, dude? <laughs> Yeah, charge them needles, see what happens. Right. Trade. Put seven in the corner. Oof. Actually, down throw up air probably kills it, it's insane, doesn't it? Can't fish for the grab though, because it's buff. Whoa. That almost, like, yeah. that was almost like, the game, which like would have been so. really great for Devin. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's it, that's it. That was yep. good. Cheek jab's so good. It's so good. It's nuts. It's almost as good as Fox jab. I mean, it would be as good as Fox jab if, you know, she had Fox up smash. That'd be a fucking character. Yeah. That really does suck about FD, the whole no one gets to come down thing. I guess it goes both, both ways though. I missed the first there. You gotta hit those. That was a big tipper. You saw the back air come out and was like, oh, you're all hitbox, aren't you? This is the hard thing, is like. Nick having Marth and Puff is kind of, um, yeah. it's kind of like, he's got one character that like dominates the air and then he's got another character that dominates the ground, so you have to have like a really different approach to yeah. each matchup. 
So like one benefit is you only really if you beat the buff, you only have to play one game there. And you can go back to alright, how do I beat Sword Man? Yeah, basically. Oh, uh, Nairin to get grabbed, that's a fun one. Yeah, that's gonna do it. Probably like what you're supposed to do against the cheek. Very rarely do I see Moth hit that Ishgard. Like, at least at that cleanly. It doesn't happen nearly as often as it probably should. I feel like Moth's one of those characters that, like, I don't know, they always seem to struggle against Sheik edge guarding, and it's just like, you roll up. <laughs> it's like, press yeah. L. You, you hit L, and it's like, that, oh, that covers coverage. half the options, and then you got the, like, the sword and the grab and the B thing to, like, cover the rest. Yeah, Nick's all over him this game. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's FD. I mean, it's, it's FD, but it's, it's like... Oh, that he's, he's, he's just like... He's fit. Like, he's just being in the annoying spots for Sheik. Yeah. Where, like, you know, Sheik's want to Sheik's wanna jump around sometimes. And Nick is just, like, in situations where he's not really... He doesn't have to go out there yeah. any further than he needs to. But he does anyway, and he gets a lot off of it. Um, and I think that's one of the things between, like, Ooh. it's kind of like a defining characteristic between uh, Nick and Spud. Like, they're two different styles. Like, Spud's very, like, push it, push it, push it, push it, push it, push it, you know? But uh, Nick's kind of like, I don't know, he's like a step. Like, he plays a step ahead, but uh, Spud kind of plays, like, Forcing those steps. I, I don't know how to explain it properly, but like, oh, oh, he's going deep for it too. It's okay. You just get to hit up air afterwards. Anyway. Yeah, up, up airs on up airs, baby. Oh, good. That was a really good slide off. It was really clutch too. Yeah. The Devon could have gotten a lot of damage off that, and all of a sudden it's like, oh, he's still at 50. <laughs> Going to stage, he's not going to get punished for it, though. Yeah, Nick, Nick grabbed ledge too late to really do a whole so lot Nick about it. So covering two out of three there, and Devon just <laughs> teching away really good. That's going to do it. Yeah, Last like Riders is real. <laughs> Hit them needles. Could have been dicey, but yeah, I'm gonna clean it up with a. I'm not sure if that was back or down. Or that was back. Okay. One of them RTJ setups. <laughs> well, They're the actually air. so good. Yeah, you get the back air. Like no one does the like um the forward throw down smash one. <laughs> like like it tippers two out of the three real options. Like oh, that was such good patience from Nick. He looked like he could have really got into trouble on that platform, but um, he actually turned it around, which is sick. Yo, anyone in chat watch Schism 3? Dino, I didn't. Do you know what tournament it was? Nope. Uh, Lucky and SJJ went to Ireland. Oh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. It was good. Was that last year or this year? Ah, uh, this year. Okay. It was like, well, they. Schism 2 was last year. Yeah, and SJJ, SJJ went, went to there. that, yeah. 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 Um, and Lucky went along as, as well at yeah, this yeah. time. <laughs> they were just playing like friendlies in grand finals. It was good. It was so good. It was Batman a, came out. It was it was uh, actually no bat no Batman, but um, some crazy sets. Well, that's what you want to say. It was really like uh, Shadowy Five. Oh yeah. It was like it was like that. It was good. Except except, Ad except you know, Adam's a huge tryhard and yeah. <laughs> oh, you're talking about the Batman took the game off him. Yeah, that's hype as fuck. Yeah, but. Adam's a tryhard. Yeah, he wouldn't. He wouldn't just do cool things for the sake of it. Hey, you thought he was a tryhard then? Yeah, he thought he was a tryhard. Fucking man. Bam. Hey, he anyway, he's on a mission. He didn't care how many times he had to force off dicks. <laughs> Legendary. It's like every time I looked over, Deeks was four to one down, and like somehow it gotten him to a hundred percent, which meant that like he'd hit him a bunch, but he like wobbled him zero times. <laughs> In like that time, I was just like, that's fucking rough against the beach. Mm. Davos can bring this back, by the way. 
Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So he's like brought it to the two stock or one stock each rather. Um, but he goes to the platform really early, and I don't know about that on this stage, especially for Sheik. You just want to be like I, I understand like waiting out the invincibility, but like he just put himself in a worse position than he needed to, yeah. and now, yeah. And now like the platforms are gone. Or well, one of them is. Oh, oh, platform warp, and he gets a hit. Oh shit. Oh, he's going deep for it. Oh, that was he a really out. good wiggle out. Yeah. yeah. He caught a jump with that. Oh, sick. That was a sick wave land off, and he catches the yep. double jump. And that's that, man. A 3-1 Nick, pretty good. Nick, you're up. Oh, shoot. You musket. Oh, yeah. man. The shit's going fast. I mean, it's 7 now. So. Yeah, but we started at 5.30. Yeah, that's what I mean. It's like an hour and a half to lose the semis. I should put that in before. That's I why I was like, yeah, let's just get these games going. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm ready to have a heart attack on stage. All right, how many coffees you had? <laughs> it's just this one double espresso. Oh, that's nothing. Just nothing. I, I really thought you were going to walk over and like play with the headset on <laughs> and just have a casual chat. <laughs> yes, you do. Looking for something. Can't find it. Moves on. Ah! You heard him enough with the like banging the mic on the thing. <laughs> Didn't need to double down <laughs> on it, man. Uh. Hello, Ruben. Hope you're having fun over there. Hope there's a lot of fun melee setups and. Uh, Fun experiences all around, because I know you like fun. I'd love, I'd love to imagine Japan just not having Samus for some reason, and him just crash canceling, like, down smashing his way through back, and then we'll be like, "What the fuck is this yeah. bullshit?" Never heard of Samus over there. Yeah. Are they playing? They're probably w warming up. They're, they're Musket's a handball. Yeah. He's definitely a handball. Who do you reckon's gonna win this? Probably Musket, but Kai has played pretty bad today. Yeah. Well, Musket hasn't played that great either. That, that's the thing. It's like everyone's playing bad. Yeah. I feel like there's just going to be one SD that like kind of defines the set. Like one, they're going to be like last stock game two, and one of them is just going to shoot off oh and yeah. lose the set. Probably Kai. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That would be such a read. Kai was about to go 2-0 up, SDs, 1-1, like, yeah. and Musk wins the set. I definitely read Ghost winning 3-1 the last Smash Ultimate tournament. So, like, maybe. We can go back to that. That's, like, not, not a huge read, though. It's, it's not a, a huge read, read, but it's, like, you know. He was playing against Rob, so, you know. What stages is Rob good on? I don't know. Nice. I don't know what stages my characters are good on. Like, what am I going to know what Rob's good on? I don't know. Intuition? Gamer sense? Yeah. Maybe. Who's in chat? Anyone? <laughs> No? <laughs> I don't know, man. Anybody? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Is anybody out there? Yeah. If you're in chat, talk shit about Kai. I now know now's got, your chance. Ruben's got like a 10 minute delay because he's in over the sea. I you're talking about. He probably gets it before we do. He's in a <laughs> country with real internet. Yeah, maybe. It's like, Ruben responds, then, like, all of Australia. All right. This is a classic. Oh, yeah. You know what used to be a classic? Musket versus Florads. Used to be. Not anymore. Not anymore. Not anymore. He switched to a character that beats my character, and I played less and less. Yeah, you didn't learn. Didn't yeah, and it's just like I started losing. It's like, yeah, that'll happen. <sighs> used to be a classic. Used to. Right, right, let's do it. You know who also plays that character, though? Davin. Yeah. And he beat Musket. <laughs> He did beat Musket. Oh my, what a shine. Why did he... I like that he ran up to the top platform, shielded, then shield drop shined, instead of just shining. 
Oh my crap. I'll just weak back at once in your life. It, it might have been fine. Alright. I feel like my combo game is so like incredibly centered on getting them off stage. Yeah. It's that's, real good. Yeah, that's what you want them to be. That's definitely what I try to do. If you weak back at them there and they DI out, then they're all the way off stage. And if they DI in, then they're dead. Yeah. Like, I feel like my goals are either combo them off stage or combo them up real high and slap them off. Like, it's one or the other. Yeah. And they're both side B to the right. Must be going the right way. Classic. Up. 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 It's like he's, it's like he's <laughs> playing a 2v1. <laughs> like, gotta get both of them. Yeah. Those, those were the most for the fans like sequence of lasers I've ever seen. Yeah. The fans really appreciated that one. Yeah. <laughs> the fans were in danger, to be honest. Wow, I didn't realize how high percent he was, so I just thought that forward throw sent him absolutely it's flying. It's like, <laughs> what is it, base knockback and I never knew? Yeah. <laughs> it's like... I do. Stop. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. <laughs> no. I get the feeling Kai's gonna like swap controls or something after I this game. I certainly hope so. I would do it mid mid game. I would just after I lose the stock, I would just unplug and plug in again. He's, he's just about winning, so yeah. Oh, what are you? Oh, what is that? <laughs> he was like trying he was to shoot like lasers he, in the right yeah. direction. Yeah, probably. But he was facing the right way. Yeah. Like he wasn't running away and shooting lasers. Oh, musket. We're playing pretty sloppy. Oh yeah. I should have entered, I probably would have come third. You're the one, dude. I'm playing terrible. Yeah, but I'm bad, so. Yeah, that's true. You know. I always forget about that. Yeah, it, it, it is the unfortunate truth. My puff didn't win because I couldn't reach the C stick. Oh, I hate that feeling. I was like, eh. It's like, I've been playing Tetris 99 and it's like, half the time I kill myself by like not rotating enough times. Ugh. It's just like, I like, I need to press it three times, then up, and then I hit it twice and up, and I'm just like, well, I'm fucked now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, why do I even bother playing this fucking game if I can't press, fucking, like, rotate three times? Instead of, you know, adapting and rotating in the correct way once. Yeah, exactly. It's like, <laughs> it's like, <laughs> I was gonna say, dude. Yeah, it's like, uh, just uh, like definitely Zoolander over, cannot yeah. turn left. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, huge. I thought he was going to back it. In fact, he probably should have back it. Because then he could have also done something with the tech end. West Ball's going to back it. Yeah. You know who forward smashes there? Ginger. Who's the one getting the results at the moment? Ginger? Yeah, probably. Yes. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's, uh, that's the best power shield I've ever seen. Yeah, just kill imagine him. if you could kill a guy off power shielding every time. It's Fal Falco would be so low tier. It would be good if um, things did more damage after pa being power shielded. Yeah, I don't know why they don't. Like yeah, power it, shielding Samus' charge shot is such a swag move that you should get rewarded for it. I know, and it, like they're at, like 150 and they still don't die. Yeah, it's just like they pop up like they've been weak back end. It's just like. Uh, it's one thing that really annoys me about Smash Ultimate Wolf Lasers, because they're like based on distance. So right. if you ref reflect them, they either don't make it back, or if they do, they like do no damage, even though they get multiplied. Wolf Lasers are good, right? They're oh, like they're the fucking Falcon amazing. Laser of yeah, they're the Ultimate. Falcon Amaz Laser of Ultimate. Which is funny to me, because they seem so much slower and worse, but I guess Ultimate just is slower. It, it's partially because it's slower, and it's partially because there's no momentum, so you can't just like box Nair straight past them. Yeah, right. You can't just full hop and be like, oh yeah, I'm all over Wolf now. <laughs> and they just have a like slightly deceptive hitbox, I want to say. They're all good. They're no Falco Laser in this, though. Yeah. Fuck, fuck, Falco would be so fucked if he had those. Well, also the fact that you can't like dash dance very well in ultimate, you can't shield that quickly out of dash. Yeah. 
Up. That. That. He almost got him with that one. Yeah. He should just start overshooting his lasers. <laughs> <laughs> well, then he wouldn't be shooting them the right way. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, you overshoot, and then if they don't dash back, you shoot behind yeah. you and you hit them anyway. Yeah, yeah that's true. You definitely should have used that laser to like get him to the ledge. Yeah. This is a pretty unfortunate display so far, <laughs> I gotta say. See, see, he doesn't need to do that laser ever, because he, he's shooting them the wrong way so many times. Well, he's probably afraid to power shift a little bit. Because <laughs> he, he knows they're not going to come the right way a lot of the time. Yeah. yeah you got to show them that. I wonder whether he tried. I assume he did. Yeah, probably. Like, I feel like he wouldn't miss that length, though. You know, like, if he was going for a mid length and got, like, a, the longer one died for it, it's like, yeah, that makes sense, but... He was going for a mid, wasn't he? No, it was just short, short. Okay, okay. it's mid. Check the heads. Yeah, we'll check later. Good. No! Oh. Uh, I don't, yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's such an unconventional laser game. I mean, I've never considered shooting 30% the wrong way. <laughs> it's probably more than that. It's probably like 60%. <laughs> it's not. I think it's just we're noticing a lot more of them going the wrong way. It's double like laser, a double laser, you won't. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's like it's definitely a flick back thing or something. Oh, yeah. Definite snap back. Yeah. Kai's text in general is. I, the thing is, once something starts going wrong with your controller, you start flubbing everywhere. Yeah. It's happened to, to me. It's happened to the best of us. Me. And, I, uh, you know who it doesn't happen to? Who? Armada, because he DQs himself from the tournament. Oh, yeah. He, he's not about that life. He, he doesn't want to be flubbing shit. He needs that, like, immortality of, I will just kill you forever. You can't risk losing it. It's, you know, he loses to Swedish and he retires. Oh, what a tech. It's oh. good. Weird choice to Nair. Well, I can't believe he reached for that. He yeah. probably, I don't think he should have. He could have jumped out of that. Yeah, but. I was thinking the same thing, but yeah. I don't, the thing about that Nair is, like, oh. it's not better than a weak bear. Weak bear, like, or a foider. No. Like, Nair off that platform is, platform is good when you can, like, land on them with the weak Nair kind of thing. And then do, a, like, a really yeah. late weak Nair. Like, unless he thought that, like, back air wouldn't send him far enough, like, the doesn't the Nair send slightly further than reverse back air? It does. Like, the back then air I could see it, but so I... Yeah. It's just... It, it, it definitely combos more often. Yeah, there yeah. is a situation where Nair is the best, and it's the one that Mango uses it for, which is the weak Nair to Dare off the top platform. But you yeah, have to yeah. do that where you fall on them with the Nair. Yeah, exactly. You, like, up air them up or something, and then Nair them or something weird. Yeah, so usually like, it's like, like shine off the top platform at like 50, then you like yeah, 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 yeah. jump above them, near fast fall down, and then like either edge cancel down air or like jump it down air. Yep. Anyway, it wasn't that. But he got the combo anyway, so who cares. You know what I watched uh, a couple of days ago? What? Fest versus Don B at City of Melee 6 high stakes. You know that combo Fest gets where he does single hit up air to single hit up air to shine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's also the tournament where I did my best ever combo in tournament. For the one on Fest? Yeah. Yeah. Fest just like such a service to, uh, to beautiful melee. Yeah, he really is. It's like he's always in the clip, like regardless yeah. of which end he's on. He's got that. Maybe he's got some chili and bite or something in him. Exactly. It's like he just wants to be in a combo video yeah. one way or another. He's trying to make fucking perfect dark two one somehow. And if it takes, you know, dying in on Blink getting shined, he'll do it. Oh, that was an air, but uh. Up tilt, yeah. Up tilt, yes. Yeah. Oh, that's crazy. That's funny. Oh, Kai's it though, yeah, he's owning him. Where did he go last game? Back to Battlefield? Dreamland. Oh, Dreamland, that's right. 
or musket land as we call it in South Australia. Yeah. We should have known. Exactly. How does musket land work against Puff? Any good? My Puff can't hit the C-stick today. Oh, okay, yeah. That's, I, no, I just, that's a bit of a problem. I kept like trying to up air and then just doing nothing and being like, oh, I didn't do a move. Have you tried just freaking people out by shield drop resting everything? It's a good strategy. It's like, it's almost as good as Falco Shine as far as shield drop stuff goes. I mean, it's smaller. It's smaller, laggier. but like, it's definitely laggier. <laughs> no, one, no one will ever dispute rest being a laggy move. And I mean, you can kill off one Shine with Falco anyway. At zero, but you can't do it with rest. Eh. I don't know. I feel like... Dude, I can kill Musket off one Shine with Valka. Yeah, probably. I think you could probably kill him off with off one <laughs> rest as well. At zero? Yeah. No. I feel like he holds down away on Shield Drop Rest. Maybe. Yeah, you know, he's probably holding down L, L cancelling and getting hit by rest. Good. Second Shine, that was dope. Yeah. Alright. Good. Kai's getting into Kaiser mode, which is when he starts moving around, wave landing all over the place and shining. It's his like at home practice mode. Ah, uh, shine grab. Probably meant to. Should shine grab again. Probably meant to. Ah, oh, that just killed him. Yeah, weak near. Real good against Falco without a jump. I'm surprised he didn't down angle forward tilt, he did four. He did the mango wave dash back in Shane. You know the mango vs. Yeah, yeah. four stuff on? On FOD? Yeah. He just didn't get the like down air down air afterwards. <laughs> yeah, that's the important part. God, that was such a good combo. Yeah, that was fucking insane. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't strike the whole game and then... Yes, yeah, good choice. I think Kai might be changing. Oh no, he's in water. Like, it didn't affect him the rest of the game, and you know, the ones on the ledge probably helped. He's got a controller right there. I'm looking at it. Yeah. It's too far away. It's definitely on the other side. That's a lot of cans he's got to get past. Yeah. Oh shit. Somebody threw something on the ground. Like, uh. What's his name? Lonely Island. You know, that guy. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Andy Sandberg. He said, I don't want your energy drink, me. I'm not going to let you poison me. All right, FD, neutral start, despite being somewhat far apart. Really neutral. He's yeah, so like neutral. They should start on the edges. <laughs> have to do a, have to do a ledge dash to start the match. <laughs> Dude, that'd end some people's careers. <laughs> like, start all the games one stock down. Yeah. I wonder whether that would be good for Fox or Falco or Falco. Because Falco can shoot a laser and kind of stop Fox from moving yeah. forward. Wow. I mean, it depends on if you can ledge dash power shield. You know, and then it turns into like any game of Mark on FD where they just like. I just did a ledge, ledge dash power shield, as you said, the ledge yeah. dash power shield. Oh my, he didn't down air, he forward smashed. Yeah. Which yeah. was probably worse, but it like, still worked. Yeah. Oh. The tournament up. <laughs> yep, that was good. Giant. That's good, it was evasive. He said, you're going to try and grab me. Oh, oh, double. You got to cover the missed tech there. Maybe he gave Muscle a lot of credit and thought he was going to hit the tech. Shouldn't have. This is happening now. Yeah. Never give Muscle too much credit. That's rule number one, actually. Never give anyone too much credit, but particularly, like, never give Muscle too much credit. Yeah, can't be giving Peach Man's credit. Exactly. You just gotta remember their first year, they just hit down on the yellow stick and were like, I'm playing the game. Yeah. I'm getting better. <laughs> what, are, what are Musket's goals in melee, you know? Do you wanna be the best in SA? I don't know what he wants to do. Because he's always saying stuff like, oh, you were saying earlier, like he might, you know, work on his peach a bit before BAM. 
What is he? You know? Yeah, like what for? <laughs> is the what are his goals? I don't know what his goals are. It's like you gotta have goals. You gotta have goals. It's actually soul crushing knowing you can't win a tournament. Yeah. Like well, the like, last time I I like went into a tournament, not intending to win the tournament was the time I bought a game. Yeah. And I played so bad. I just yeah. like, <laughs> came like ninth. So it's just like, well, what's the point, you know? Not that you know, I didn't get destroyed by good players, but uh. No, it's that mentality. Like once you lose that, it's like. Yeah. You, know, you need that arrogance of yeah, I'm just gonna walk in, beat everyone, and walk out with my money. Yeah. Exactly. Because otherwise, it's like yeah. Oh. Yeah, this is not the stage you want to be doing oh. that on. That's three in a row. Are you sure it's not 60%? I mean, he, he got a lot in game. Oh, three that's in it! A row. Weak there. Yep. Get down. Let's go anti SD. Alright, so we already had the set defining SD in game one, which means that Musket's going to win game five. I mean, makes sense. Otherwise, it wouldn't be set defining. Unless we're going to see another one. Ooh, that would be really set defining. Yeah. Double power shield to Musket SD? <laughs> he's trying to double laser or something. Oh, that'd be so sick. <laughs> that actually would be a read. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't know about the stage. Musket is getting comboed, and he didn't finish off Kai on the last two chain grabs. He also didn't like attempt the the kill combo. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just realized you're not. Shine grab there. Every time you hit anyone with like a ascending dare and you can't combo into a shine, they're always gonna shield. Unless they're like super sick and they shine. But so you should always just shine grab there. Yeah, yeah. Because like if they shine, you got hit anyway. And if you shine, like, I don't know, shine grab is the best option. Yeah, every yeah. Time. Or maybe regular grab, depending on what they try to do. Shine Grab's like, it's one of those things that everyone knows is fucking busted and no one does. Yeah, that actually doesn't work on me because I roll out in that situation, but... But like, you know what I mean, like, yeah. there's plenty of situations where it's like, the option that covers so much and like, forces respect and it's just, no one does it. Yeah, you can make him roll, that's good. You can punish rolls. They're just committing to like a whole second of yeah. not doing attacks. That's good. Ooh, get kicked. Yeah. Oops, I'm gonna kill. He did that last time as well. Oh, in the first game, sorry. First FP game. Yep. You gotta know your percents. Yeah. He could have charged as well. Like, I feel like he needed to do, to do like the raw up smash. He could have done a charge. Maybe his goal was to kick him more. You know? Yeah. Again, up smash is demoralizing. It is, but he was at 100. Like, there's no combo out of that. But he'd already got, like, he hit four up smashes that stock. You don't want to get up smash four times in the stock. Then that happens, see? That's a pretty brutal stock. Yeah. It's like he was demoralized by getting up smashed, and then he got grabbed, and he was like, ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, that's true. He's demoralized into shooting lasers the wrong way and getting chain grabbed. Oh, oh no. Do something on wake up, please. Oh, he's trying to run away. Like, Falco's not fast. No, he's Like he's a jab not. or something, or like a, you know, something. There's a lot of up air in his combo game. I think that's why he doesn't go for reverse back air. He's not good at it. <laughs> it's like, gonna cost him? No. Ooh, good down air. Yeah. Weird. No, don't take him now. Can't take him. Oh, uh, it's gonna do it? No. That I mean, was... it probably is gonna do it. Like, yeah. Yeah, it's tough, though. Alright, so... Kai loses as a result of a Game 1 SD, yeah. as predicted as by predicted. Flow Rats. Unfortunate for him, but, you know... Alright, so... Fate decreed it. The Big Cheese said, let there be an SD. And there was a self-destruct. Kai's not happy about it. Have Such is life, you know? Sometimes you shoot the laser at them, sometimes you shoot the laser away from them. <laughs> And, and in that situation, <laughs> how do you shut the laser away? You know, it's a totally different set. Yeah, exactly. It doesn't go down 0 2. Oh, I mean, yeah, <laughs> you're right, actually. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> he was banking on that 60%. Yeah. 
So this if is anything, why I wish we were a big stream and we could get the Tapo stats on how many lasers he shot away. He would be like, oh, it was, I'm gonna go it was only 54. Yeah. Because <laughs> sometimes he would shoot like three in a row, like in a single yeah. full hop as well. Well, the only reason I thought it was lower was because there was like a solid like game where he didn't shoot one for like the bulk of it and then shot two or three at the end. But it was like, he definitely shot Lenny on that uh, FD. Yeah. Not FD, um, fog game. He shot enough reverse lasers to make a difference to the set. He definitely, yeah. Like, <laughs> he didn't shoot the one that mattered though. Not gonna say that he would have won, because that's like, he probably, he may not have or wouldn't have, but like, that's an amount of lasers that will decrease your standard play by like 10% or more. Anyways, I think Davox is uh, likely to take this one again. This is looking clean as today. Yeah. Oh, that down smash just clean beat Fox's thrill, even on like the third hit of it. Yep. Oh. Uh, yes. Alright. Too easy. Yeah. The one phrase uh, that always comes to mind when I talk about Sheik or think about Sheik is wife telling me or saying something to like a group of us in uh, 2015. No, oh, yeah. Sheik is, is mostly known for being sinfully easy. I've always yeah. thought of the phrase sinfully easy like ever since then. It is, it's a sin. Yeah. Much like. I don't think I've ever paid as much as for a meal as that one. Which one? The like, the Bam Seven like fucking. Uh, I don't think I went to that. Oh, you didn't? No, because it's so expensive. <laughs> yeah. See. <laughs> we have to sit on a table with wife and like, I don't know, talk about how um, Jakey's friend had the worst tag ever. What was it? Telefunken. How is that the worst tag ever? I don't know. It was pretty bad. Oh, wife's pr worst tag. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> wife is a pretty bad tag. It's like hindsight. It's like, yeah, it's not a good. What about Mewtwo King? What about Hungry Box? Actually, Hungry Box pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, man. Telefunk, it's pretty bad. No, Telefunk, it's fine. <laughs> he read it off a TV and was like, this is good enough. Yeah. Wife literally has no idea. Scrattles, thank you for bringing that to my attention. I'm upset. Chew that's a good tag. Yeah. Maybe wife didn't watch the documentary and didn't know the uh, the origin of the tag. Maybe he knows the origin and he was just sick of it. <laughs> he, he was the one that had to originally deal with Chew that back in the day. You know, I love the scene in the documentary where they're walking through the like ritzy restaurant. You know the one where wife's like, this place is so ritzy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And they, they get, go up to Chew that and he's like, hey, man, easy on the camera, dude. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Maybe the best shootout moment ever. And he's had a few. Yeah. Also the emote in one of the discords, or like pod if you're familiar with that collective of humans, is a shootout lunch. And it's the one where it's just a small slice of bread and a really big sausage with a coke life. <laughs> <laughs> and the bread one? is like... Like, the bread only covers, like, one quarter of the sausage, but it's yeah. on the furthest quarter of the sausage, and the, the three quarters is, like, trailing off of the sausage. Was this a meal he had while he was yeah, here? Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, I don't know. It's, like, food photography that he does and puts on uh, yeah. Twitter, you know? I, I did love that he, like, had the um, fucking what you thought, meat pie from 7-Eleven. Put oh, that he, on Twitter. He's about it. Damn, Musket takes that one clean. Yeah. Two stocks to, to zero. Two nil. That is how melee works. Someone, <laughs> yeah. someone always ends up losing. The other guy doesn't win. You yeah. lose. A lot of, lot of uh, uh, very few three-two games in melee. Yeah. Oh, there are a few though. Yeah. It happens. Not yeah. so much since the uh, banning of certain stages. Yeah. And the lack of young Link in tournament play. Yeah. Like it's been a while since I've seen a three-to-two game. That's for sure. Oh yeah. That said, Hbox playing Falco against Young Link popped up on my YouTube today, and I was like, oh, I'm always down to watch that. <laughs> the the H-Bird is sick, dude. Like, 
I don't know, man. The footage I saw. Oh, it, <laughs> like, it. H bread's actually good. You remember uh, Hungry Box uh, Falco friendlies with Mango, Mango, where he won like three in a row of uh, Falco Dudes? No, I do not remember this. When did <laughs> this was really this summit? Was summit yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was really funny. It was like live streamed by like Mike Hayes or something. Oh yeah. yeah. And every time Hungry Box won, he like tweeted. <laughs> And then Hungrybox tweeted being like, it's crazy to think if Puff, if I didn't pick Puff, like, whether I'd be a Falco man today. <laughs> is Mango just bad at Falco Duros? Because that's what it looks like. I think it's just him not playing the matchup. I think it's a very uh, rock, paper, scissors heavy matchup. Isn't that what he's good at, though? Kind of, but you can just lose. Yeah, that's true. And the true. punishes are big. That is very true. And he doesn't play it in a very, like... Dr. Pee esque way where he can like avoid the mix ups. He just enters into mix ups. Yeah. He's like, I'll be fine in this mix up, I'll win. Yeah. And then, you know. Then we have to lose eight. Oh, I didn't kill. Oh, uh, yes. Okay. Yeah. He cleans it up. I thought he was just going to run up up smash, but Drill Shine did yeah. the trick. Surprised he caught, like, the back dash one, like slightly harder, and you have to actually, you know, know which way you're going to send it with the shine. Oh yeah. Plus, it's all about like being good at a few things. Yep. The shine up smash is one of those things you'd like to be good at. Yeah. Because we've all seen Fox players like last stock hit the shine and then like attack and knock at the stock. Oh yeah. And then get I don't know, cheek back it or something. Yeah, Fox has never combo me out of Shane. Only Fox in Australia that combos Marth out of Shane is Duck. And luckily he's never actually played a set against me where he tried. <laughs> just didn't get any shines or? No, like he, he just played against me one time and just sandbagged and lost really badly. Oh, okay. And just did up smashes in place repeatedly. I was like, uh, okay. <laughs> Never been so disrespected in a set that I won. And like, it was clear that I was winning. It was like, it was disrespecting me as I was winning. Oh, there's sort of like two docks stuck down like Falcon Punch. It's just like, what are you doing? Yeah. And like, Gooch had money on Duck winning against oh, me. Oh, get wrecked. Yeah, get wrecked. Uh, that's a grab release. So I won the tournament entry and I won a bet against Gooch that I would beat Duck. <laughs> Duck just didn't try at all. Secretly, he had money on you as well. Duck, yeah, probably. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. It is 2-0. Yeah. It really Let's is 2 run away with it. Damn, get grabbed. No, he just up tilted. Uh, I, guess, I guess he expected the fade back. Getting hit by both hits of... Oh. Ronaldinho. That would uh, so good had he grabbed the fucking ledge. He wanted. To, he got greedy with the like double jump up back air that I yeah. used. Oh, what a grab again! He's insane. I hit Deca with so many of those grabs at uh, City of Melee High Stakes Six, or whatever it was. <laughs> Which I don't know why I was rewatching that whole tournament, but but you just. Started the playlist and was like, "Well, I'm committed now." Yeah. Is that the one where you beat Decca real bad in Grants? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. A classic twenty. Definitely kind of low point in Vic Smash when you were just going over there and like farming them pretty much. Yeah. Like, no Vic, resistance at all. Vic was going for me at that point, because that was Duck Decker. Yeah. If you remember. I, I do remember Duck I hated Duck Decker, dude. <laughs> oh my. Oh, uh, that's the worst guy I've ever seen on a shine. <laughs> Holy crap. Like, he was in the bubble on Fountain before he, like, you yeah. got hit. He just teleported through the stage into the blast zone somehow. Yeah, he got stadium glitched. Yeah. Wow. That's the thing about Shine, it's about as good as Wobble. Yeah. It can kill at zero, unlike a Wobble. Uh, wobbles can kill at zero. Not if you mash. Not if you mash, yeah. Whereas that Whoa. Shine, there was no counterplay to you. 
Well, had he mashed <laughs> up instead of down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, you know, <laughs> angular mash. Two. Two. Yeah. Two. 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 Oh. What even happened there? How did he, how did he so late? He canceled it. Because <laughs> of the um, right. platform moving down. Oh, he could have shined. That was a miss shine. That was a stuff. Yeah, must get kind of getting robbed that stuff. Yeah. Two, two. What are you? That's insane. Can no one shoot in two, the right direction? Two, it's hard. Two, I can't yeah. even neutral be in the right direction as well. I, I did one in my set against Elvis. Oh, damn. No one can do it. Oh, Kai, maybe. I'm not sure. But... Two. Now that we've all got new controllers in UCF, people have stopped carrying back controllers, so everyone has snapback. <laughs> Only Don B has the snapback capacitor breaking Dombe, tournaments. Yeah, exactly. That's why he's still a top player. Among other reasons, like fundamentals. Yeah, fundamentals are pretty good. Patience. He definitely has more patience than like probably the rest of Victor. Oh, what a recovery. <laughs> what a He's gonna cheese him back there. Oh, he could have gone back there. Back right now. <laughs> These are good players. <laughs> uh, so which one of these guys are you most scared of playing? I don't know, dude. It's been a rough day for, for Melee. Yeah. I blame the, the new conditions in this room. The climate, the, uh, the ambience. The high stakes kind of stage environment. Yeah. Oh, with, must with, get. With, with sadly very little on the line. Oh, yeah. Pride. Pride, yeah. Devin's last tournament in South Australia. Oh, that's right, he flies back tomorrow, doesn't he? He's going to be here on Sunday. He's looking to make it count. Yeah. Get absolutely needled. I love that that doesn't do the full damage with the grounded ones do. It's like... Nair to up tilt is better than Nair to grab that. Don't add me, just get. Do not. Whoa, he's oh. insane! But he's going to up tilt. In fact, he could have just up tilted. It would have been better if he had up tilt afterwards. But... But he insane. killed it. So exactly. who gives a fuck? That's the thing about melee. There's like a million ways to skin a cat and we're all trying to figure out the best one. And it's like... It's if the other guy dies... Is there really not a best one? Well, he didn't die in that interaction. He died yeah. subsequently. And it's not that easy to juggle Sheik with Fox. Like, it's very easy with Moth. Yeah. But uh, you kind of got a shock with Fox a bit more. Can't just use moves. Let's grab. Ooh. Oh, Davin's looking good. Will there be another set defining SD? Oh, yeah. I love the idea from us of if I just shoot enough lasers, this will beat the needles. <laughs> I mean, he's already committed to shooting one. So. Yeah, so it's like, might as well mash it. Uh, weak bear, yes. Oh, shit. Get him. Up to, no. He has to get out. So smart. Yep, I've seen that combo before. Yep. <gasps> Good choice. Sometimes you gotta meet him up there. Uh, oh, what a crazy. Rolled. It's a good choice, like just waiting on the ledge and not doing an option. Jig's got no hitboxes. Better come back and not make it. Uh, Must yeah. get up attacks more than average. And with Fox, it's not that good. No, I I With wonder how many of them he's buffering and how many he's actually thinking this is the idea. No, I think he meant to do that one. Yeah, probably. But like, there's been a few where I'm like, oh, he probably was trying to do something and got hit out of something. But that one was definitely a... Should have hit the tech, like, let alone the... Yep, that's it. Oh, he should have done it. Thought he could have up-tilted, but... Yeah. As long as he doesn't hold straight down on a shine, he should be okay. It's been known to happen. We'll do it. Up there, now. Oh.
And we got a tight battle here. Yep. Very tight battle. Doesn't get any tighter than this, folks. It's 2 2. We got Muskets counterpick, but Davin with the momentum. Sheik Fox, two characters, with a variety of moves. Right. Jumps. I, I kind of like this from Musket. He's 0 and 3 on FD so far. Yeah, I across agree. the two sets, so you might as well try something different. Musket's just like, his internal logic is like, well, I'm lame, so FD must be good. And uh, it's actually not that good. Dude, up throw only does 2% if the lasers don't hit. That's kind of sad. Yeah. That's, that's not a good move. I mean, it is. It, like, like it is because it. you get like up air that does a whole lot more than two, but still. I remember looking at the Prima guide back in the day. Ooh. And uh, Moss throws did such low damage, I was like, what's the point? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you trust, trust in the Prima guy, it's not the greatest option. Well, they do do low damage. Well, that, well, that is true. That's the, that's uh, see, I, the worst I never had in the game. <laughs> I, I <laughs> see, I had the Brawl one, warning against using Meta Knight. You know, 6 out of 10 character. It's yeah. like he's got a sword, but he doesn't have that much range. That's true. Moth, on the other hand. Yeah, 9 out of 10 character. Super good. Oh, that's good. Yeah, his combos are way better here, and his juggles weren't that good in FD, but now he's dead. Oh, no what a tag. tag. I thought he was going to back up, but he nerd, which... Why wouldn't you just infinite? GG's. Yeah, good. Good reaction. Because, like, with the wall there, surely you can just wave shine into it forever, and then just up tilt or something, and... Yeah. You know like, how there's like, like pushback thing where if you hit oh, them too yeah, many times yeah, in one combo, you get pushed backwards? And then maybe because there's the edge there, if you get hit all the way to the edge, you can like uh, slide yeah, off the yeah, yeah, I could say that. But I don't know. It's just such a rare occurrence, that I guess. I'm sure you can drill shine infinite. Yeah. If you can do that. I remembered how difficult melee attack skill actually is, because I tried playing non-claw. Oh, yeah, which yeah. Which is impossible to do anything. Like, sometimes like it blows my dash. mind, people that, like, chill and dude can multi-shine with um, stick jump. Yeah. It's like, that's crazy. Oh, I couldn't short hop. I couldn't do anything. You should have been able to short hop. It's like... My thumb is just doesn't do that anymore. It's just, it's just out of practice, you know? I mean, I'm sure I'll get there with some, yeah, if I practice non-claw for some yeah. reason, then I'm sure I can get there, but I was like, why would be, yeah, yeah. I was just kind of curious, because I was playing like some other game on the GameCube that didn't require claw. Yeah. Ikaruga or something. Oh, yeah. The game's good. It is good. It's a lot of bullets. It is a lot of bullets. Like, you know, only half of them hit you. Yeah, it's true. Did you turn your CRT sideways flat? Uh, I had. So I was reading Cube magazine in 2001 or two, <laughs> and uh, they suggested that. They did it at Avcon once. I think they had the Dreamcast fight stick on it. it had the sideways CRT. It was like the arcade. Nice, dude. Uh, Cube magazine was fire. That was a magazine. Yeah. Worth playing the game of. I'm pretty sure I can't hit you through the tree, but maybe if something goes through the ground, I'll get it. I remember reading Cube Magazine and uh, they had a review of Winning 11 6, or which is like the Japanese version of Pro Evolution Soccer. Oh, yeah. yeah. And apparently it was like the best damn soccer game ever on the GameCube, better than FIFA. And I went through so many trials and tribulations to get it. And my dad went to Japan one time, brought it back, but it was for PlayStation 2, so I couldn't play it anyway. <laughs> and uh, I never played it. I was so hyped to like go through all the names and rename like Van Nistel Grab to Van Nistel Roy. You know how they have like fake names? Yeah, yeah. In uh, Pro Evolution. But I never well, just like in most of them. Like, you ever play Ricky Ponting Cricket? Yes. They I only have. bought Ricky Ponting. <laughs> Every <laughs> other name is. They had like, they had the World Cup, all the World Cup squads from 2003, I'm pretty sure, but they didn't have anything else. Yeah. My other favorite is Aussie Rules Free for the NES. <laughs> Gross. It's just that like, terrible. you could play as Purple Darwin and shit. It's like they didn't get the teams at all. Purple Darwin. <laughs> it's just like you get to pick a color and a city, basically. Nice. Anyway, you're playing. Yeah. All right.
ini. What's going on, man? That's the spirit. I'll be here um, Sunday as well. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah, for the whole day, not, not the last 10 minutes. Uh, the best, that'll be a power move to like rock up like as we're packing up. Hey man, here to help you, help pick up, uh, you know, clean up. Come here for yeah. Carry one T, I'll tell you over, but I'm not carrying that with that big heavy one. That's why we were there last time. I don't know. No, it's, no. Uh, last time I was here, Everyone said it, like it was a two-person job, and to me it was clearly a one-person job. So I just, was, I, I was it like it that up. one, or uh, what was it? Eddie's massive one. It was a big one. It might have been Eddie's. Uh, who knows? Whatever. The point is, everyone was saying it was a two-person job. So yeah, it's, it's like, like no, this is a one. I just picked it up, like, and then everyone was amazed. Well, like I, sometimes I picked it yeah, up. Yeah, sometimes the like really big CRTs are easier with one person than two. Mm, yes. but, yeah. It depends on like how good the grips on the sides are. Well, the grips were, were, were fine. It yeah. was like mildly heavy. Like, some like those, they don't really mm. grip at all. I'm sure, the one I have at home is heavier, mm. and it doesn't even have those nice grips. Yeah, I should put a L to Davox because he's a loser. Ooh. Hold that. Yeah, I saw uh, uh, game four and five. Mm. Yeah, that was a really sick set. Yeah, quite close. Musket definitely was up early and then wasn't up so much. Yeah, like, like watching him play game four, I was like, man, he's he's stopped playing. And he's just gonna win. But then no. I suppose Nick's still been winning everything in the last like three weeks or something. I've been going. How long is oh it? yeah, he doesn't show up on Sundays though, so it's literally not been since the last day back to him. Okay, here he is. Which I think was like two days before the Sunday, but still. Uh, I was oh. say, he's probably going to lose the first dog, but what idiots! Oh, no. oh my god! Giving each other a few chances. No, keep him safe. Nice. Try to get him before he lands, but he didn't. So we keep playing oh, nice. this game. Yeah, up tilt's real good so there. I probably would have tried out B or like well, thought like, about it and then yeah, been dumb. Like, you've got so many options in that situation, but you it's one of those ones where it's like, I really just don't want to, like, have to deal with the cheat coming back again. Because <laughs> of the slow roll. Like, once you get the slow roll with Mars, it actually is difficult to edge guard cheek. So, like, that's sort of one where you're like, please hit this up B and kill. You don't want to grab because you don't want to keep repeating the situation. Mm. The up two was great because you can, like, arm stack the other options. Up, which yeah. At least up B. Yeah. Allegedly. He caught the drop. He's should have been done, but thought the follow. But he could, he's could the just return to stage yeah. and been fine. But wanted to make it final. It was already over. Well, that's a punish. Yep. Hey, he's keeping down throw nice and unstale. Oh. Probably did more than down throw would have. Baited the shield grab. Oh. Oh. Yeah, he's not. I. Mean, a lesser moth would have died. Yeah. I haven't got it with some kind of similar stuff. Oh, no, Nick got that one with that. Like, it was one of those ones where Sheik drops Nair and kind of just kills Marth, but they traded, so they both died. Some good sequence from Nick here. Yeah. Even, uh, even with the slide off from the up tilt, he's still able to keep this whole thing flowing. Just forward smashes him. Not a lot that... Damn, but yeah, even, that's even though I say that, he's still living. That's yeah, going to start to be perhaps a little bit tricky. Yeah. Oh, oh, the Sheik landing hitbox. I guess that's why you don't do the up tilt so often. Yeah, maybe if he did it like a you know, slightly slower. Yeah, probably like, you know, Fox stacking your shield where you just wait that like half second and then grab him. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You hate to see that one happen. Oh, gets another grab. Ooh, he's in the fan jab forward tilt. He hit the he like jabbed him out of the, the grab. Was yeah. Great. Didn't sweet spot, but you know, you know no needles to stop him. So well, yeah, she's she's really good if she can get off stage or to the ledge against Mark, but doesn't have a whole lot for 
hitting him as he's coming up, like from stage. You can you can needle it, right? Yeah, but you can't you can't like moth down tilt it or something. You know, you can't you can't really just pull out the timing and kill yeah. a guy. It needs a few more uh, a few more hits yeah. beyond that, but that's a good way to stop it. Good way to hit that particular thing. Or you can just I think you actually can just space out and like forward to it. But then I guess there's the eye from that uh, battlefield. No, he just fucked up. Yeah, sure, well, it's been a sloppy it day, was man. on Battlefield. It, it was a sloppy that, that match. That is true. No, man. See, I'm not even putting in the right score. I saw glimpses of uh, intelligent play, but, you know, it's not all coming together. Yeah. You need to... <laughs> oh, he got Westbolt so hard. He's just like, oh, port three, port four. Hold down. Oh, press A. Get the first hit. Oh. I think that's, like... I mean, the only thing that's really hurt Nick today is he hasn't finished any of these like Ken combos or how Ken combos or, or yeah. stuff he's gone for. He's well, I'm not sure. Today, but yeah, I think on the one he tried there, he probably did have to do the power version because it just wasn't yeah. gonna wasn't gonna link. But he like, I think he might not have gone for him because when it's set against Davos, he missed two of them oh. on the stage where he just like upbeat and it was like, well, I didn't die and I didn't get hit, but like. She comes back for free. And that part should be pretty easy if you know if you know to oh, go I think for it. He, I think he was going for like up air, up B or something. Like, you know. Oh, like they, they weren't, oh, like I can't remember what the move was, but I don't think it was like a standard, you know, fair dare, fair up B sort of thing. Like it was a little bit different. A little bit like, cool. Oh, nice grab. Like it definitely wasn't a just standard. From, uh, UCF? What happened? I don't he know, didn't man. dash back. He just turned around and stood there. Maybe a mental error. Oh, nice grab. Yeah. Yeah, from the middle of Yoshi's cheek. Short hop land. No impact on the platforms. No. Yeah, no uh, something a lot of characters can do actually is the slide off the A on platforms. Not just Fox against Moss. Yeah. Even like there was a situation yeah. earlier with the uh, cheek back air was just at low enough percent where it looked like he did slide off yeah. and have Davin's pretty good about that. I don't know how Nick's slide offs are against Sheik. Uh, I know his slide offs, like, if, I, I've played him uh, Fox Mouth. His Fox, Miss My Mouth. His slide offs are very good. Yeah. He, he always, but it's just like one of those things. for it, but. Like, uh, two, two. No. It's just an idea. Yeah. Two. Jumps out. Oh, he tries to space out. He just gets a bit wrong. That's that's the story of melee, right? Oops. Close. Also, uh, uh, Nick is not a fox. Oh, yeah, might be. At least not currently. Moth Black. Yeah, it is. At least for this game. Oh, that's yeah. gonna, yeah. There we are. Oh, why not? That like looks like it should have hit. Yeah, it like, could I think have been that, the stage. Yeah, I was about to say, I think that might have been a Yoshi thing. Or it might have been just a little bit too high percent. So actually, yeah. it does still work, I'm pretty sure. Even if they hold pull in. Interesting. Yeah. I don't know that, but. I'm sh surely at a side of Well, yeah, like. I don't know. Obviously, at like it's 500, probably, it's, prob it's probably it's starting to kill. Right. It's probably the stage. Yeah. Oh. Because, yeah, Nick's the sort to no percent at the stage. Excellent. Well, yeah, that's not an up air. That's the problem with forward air, is even if you tipper it at that low percent, you get charge cancel. Oh, why was he going for the side B? What kind of follow up do you get after that? Or oh, is he just trying to stall? I don't know. Maybe there's something. Because he didn't have a jump, I don't know. Ooh, that just kills. Got it. Oh, the taunt. Alright. It's game two. So even though the game is not like a blowout, it's still uh oh there we go. Oh okay. Trying to prove a point. Yeah. The final game. And loses, you got no you got no buffer. Yep. You already used it up. I wonder if you just slide off more in general as well. I think just the fact that Fox 
you know, ball speed is higher. Yeah, it's it's probably it's like, he comes up way more often, yeah. and more importantly. He, he lands with the platforms a lot more than combos, so yeah, he, you get more practice at it. Which is why you don't see Marths do it that much. Yeah, like they do do it. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, Nick having a good laugh about that. He knows he shouldn't that, that one. Yeah. Sometimes you just get stocks. And, uh, you're happy for it. Ooh. The drift. Oh, the poke. How did he get away with that shit? It's uh, 2019. 2019 Fox Tech. You know, uh, from ledge. Yeah, yeah. I was a pioneer of that back in the day, actually. Yeah, well, it's good to know. Pretty cool. There, maybe something of a visionary. Not, not quite working out, but he's got games to play with, so. Yeah, he's got games, he's got stages. He's got stocks to play with, too. It's not over. Yeah. Yeah, and. Yeah. You see it's up. even. Yep. You old NTSA. You just get to press up on the yellow stick and watch the guy die at 100. Yeah, that is. Or you can press the down B button. And they could die at any percent. Yeah. Who, who knows? It's one of my favorite memories playing Smash. When I played Fox against Captain's Falcon. Yeah, it was the first time I ever played. It was on this stage. I was down two stock, uh, down two stocks to one. And I was looking dire for me. Or maybe I was. I, maybe it wasn't exactly down two stocks to one, but I was down. It's looking dire. I get like a back throw shine, and I just hear Nick, because there was a bunch of people watching, I hear Nick in the background yell, yeah, lame, and that was just, it filled me with such joy. And then I won that game. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy, even Stevens. Alright. Oh. You don't want to get caught with an up air like that, he was lucky to get out to get up attack. GI down. No reactions. Show Play. grab, trying to show grab. I love the idea of that down tilt. But like, I guess you have to know. Yeah, it's a good shot salt. Nice, nice uh, down there from the ledge. It worked out. Yeah, just grab. Ooh, got the strong hit. I suppose it's... What, is this, can you get the... I don't want to ask this question right now. Oh, up throw. Good old pal sheet combos. Yeah, that's gonna do it. Yeah, that's it. It's over. Yeah. I was gonna say, can you get the? Is it possible to get the weak hit like early in the hitbox, or is it only? Oh, no. is it, we're talking. Uh, Fox back air. Can you get a weak hit like during this during the early frames? No, because you get the strong um reverse back air. Okay. I'm it's pretty sure it's all strong and then all weak. Right. It's just to do with the yeah. length. It's not like a. I mean, it's like, like every move is like that, except for like. Well, like there's a lot of moves with like different hitboxes, right? Because mm. I know I thought Falcon maybe you could get a weak hit, but Caleb told me no, it's a strong hit everywhere for the first. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's just it's just the time. So. It's not like his down air where there's the spike hitbox and the non-spike hitbox. Mm. Yeah. I was like, I found out Falco's down air in Ultimate has three hitboxes. Neat. So you got like the nipple spike type one, which is the strongest part of the down air. Did you say Falco or Falcon? Falco. Okay. Right. So like the upper part of his body is like the strong, or like you know, of the hitbox is the stronger the bit. The torso. Yeah, and the like bit you'd think is the strong isn't actually that strong. The the boots. Yeah. This was the middle part is like his legs. Is that? Yeah, I, g I guess there's like I don't know how they overlap or whatever, but like mm. you definitely get it up top, and you definitely get the weak one down the bottom. Kind of fat sausages. And then like you get the pal if you do it early, like if you hit late. If you're late. Yeah. Right. So but you can like, like straight up combo that into double jump fair and like drag them to the last one because Smash Ultimate's weird. The the pal one. Yeah. Right. Okay. I was gonna say. So you just throw it out as an edge guard and if right. they get hit by it, you just get like, fair. My only experience with Smash Ultimate is playing like half an hour of three player free for alls with no items but stage morph on. I lost I, a game to stage morph and it just I, pissed me off. I have yet to try stage morph. Did it you see pissed the me Nintendo off so badly? I just online like the tournament uses stage morph and Smash I Rolls. don't know if I I don't and Paper Mario the stage. I saw it used items like all on low, and I was like, oh, what are you doing? Well, it's, well like, it's, you have to set them all on, but it's just Smash Balls. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. At least the like, Australian one is. No Smash Meter, though. No, no I final know. Smash like, Meter. I, st I got stage more. No. Like, I, I came like, like under the stage, and I died, yeah. and then lost the game. I was so but like, so here's bad. the kicker. They put the first one on is on next weekend, Phantom Weekend. Yeah. There's just another one, and then there's 
The, clear, final, clear, the finals are on at Expand Gong. So, clear you know, your calendars, people. Got fucking, Get ready for Nintendo they, tournament. They put three fucking tournaments in a month and somehow hit two majors. No, no, no. And didn't it Get go ready. against fucking Tasmania, which is like the one and only. You want to do the interview? The interview? I guess I can do it. Do the interview? Right. Oh, how do you so feel today? Here we have Lemons. SA Nick. <laughs> no, I'm doing the interview. No, I'm doing the interview. All right, fine. All right. Lemons. Yeah. You, what you just witnessed was a clinic. How do you feel spiritually? I wouldn't use that thing? word. I wouldn't <laughs> use that word. It was a close, you know, it was one of those things where you walk away and you're like, well, it, it, was, was, it was close, but then they said, what was the score? It was 3 0. It was a clinic in providing entertainment to the people. Mm, and know. in spectacular swag adocious melee. Mm. What do you think about uh, Marth, the slide off of the. In the slide of DI, using it with Marth. I don't know, there was a situation I saw where you got back air with a chic back air and it was like low percent. I was like, you probably got a slid off there, but he didn't. You, could, you always do it with Fox versus Marth. I, I played your Fox, you always do it on yeah. the up tilts, but you didn't do it that time. Maybe maybe that's something you could think about. That's true, actually. It's I a little, little edges. You know, learn from me and you, one day you might be the best. That's true. That's the moral. Um, I just got a text message from my housemate saying that I should go Wh which one? Oh, don't worry but my, my <laughs> friend my one? friend Clyde oh him saying that uh, he's hanging out at my other friend Beckett do you want to come to Beckett's house? what now? yeah what are we go What are we going to do there? play Mario Brothers? Clyde will be there Beckett will be there what are we Beckett's gonna do? girlfriend who's, who's a model will be there oh boy now I can't <laughs> wait to go what, what are we, what are we going to be doing there? Uh, just talking? yeah come yeah, to Beckett's house you know I don't know I'm too much of a gamer to just talk you know what I mean I can't can't talk to people. That's no, you can actually talk to people. Yeah, can You're not that much of a gamer. I can you only didn't, talk. You didn't look, enter this tournament. I can only talk. Yeah, well, that's true. I would have if I if I came here earlier though. Can I bring lemons? I'm just texting now. Okay. Well. We'll catch a bus there, and then I Clyde will drive somewhere. Right. <laughs> Probably just, not to your house. <laughs> it's just that. Like, I don't talk that well with people I don't know, you know? You, I know, gotta, I gotta, you know Clyde? I know Beckett and Clyde, that's you know true. Me. I can talk to them. I can talk to you. I can't well, talk to his girlfriend, probably. Maybe I will. We need, we, I need, like, a... I need something to break the ice for me to talk to people. Usually, like, a game or something. There'll be, there'll be games. Okay. There'll be the name hat game. There'll be Articulate, which is basically the <laughs> name hat game, but games. in a board game. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> there'll be some other shitty card game that they were playing last time that I didn't like. Oh, yeah, what was it? I don't know. I mean, okay, well, do you have any It was one of those clues? games where every card has a different picture on it, and it's like an animated picture. Not an magic. An anime picture? But, it, like, but it's like a five-minute game, you know? Like, one of those tiny, like, you get five cards, and you got to, like, quickly... It could have been a game... I don't know what it's called. Like Tony Actually, no, it was totally different to what I'm describing. It was like <laughs> a card game crossed with Mafia, now that I remember. So, like, Mafia or Werewolf? It wasn't either of those things, but it was basically Mafia. Anyway, uh, secret we'll get no, some no, food... Secret Hitler. Have you played that game? Oh, my phone's out of batteries. <laughs> oh, now you're not going to see his reply, so you guys no! will, never, you will never know if what it's okay. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> now, have you ever played Secret Hitler? I played it like uh, seven times. See, this is why you should come like to Vegas. Five, five out of seven times, I was Hitler. Or maybe it was eight times. Unsurprising. I was like, almost, almost every time I was Hitler. And then, like, you, the, even the times I wasn't Hitler, I was still a fascist. I just wasn't Hitler. Yeah, and then only only one time, right at the end, I wasn't. I was the, one of the good this guys, is, but nobody believed me because every time I was Hitler. Well, then you're more likely to not be Hitler. This is knowledge yeah. that I could have just gained that, by listening did, to the lemons. Rap, that by didn't the way. convince me. The lemons. <laughs> I already knew have you, you were fascist. Have you? <laughs> I don't think that was a line. You could maybe you could it maybe was, was implied a little bit, but that's some creative. You don't think anyone should get the vote? <laughs> that's that's not true. There's a specific group. Which is why I might not be able to, you know, be good pals with Beckett's girlfriend. You ever think about that? She's not a fascist. Exactly. There's, there's Even a though Beckett's a policeman. So he's yeah. kind of... <laughs> I don't know how she'll feel about my opinions on uh, women's rights. You know what I mean? Which are, are, are perfectly just, normal. Are you just, are you just put off because normal. they said she was a model? No. No. I don't know. Listen, what, what she do works do? in like a florist now, I'm pretty sure. She, she, like she, like she, work, she works... Uh, Somewhere I don't know. Um, Point is, you don't have to be intimidated. Mm. You could be a model. I maybe. It depends what for. Yeah. Yeah. Right, it it uh, always depends what for. I don't know. I just need to know what's happening. You know. I don't want to. I don't well, want to show up <laughs> and just like sit there. Look, maybe that's the problem. Maybe I'm too much of a you know. 
Stick yeah, in the mud. You're full of beans. That's what you are. You got I'm ants in your pants. Of, I'm not full of beans. I did not <laughs> fill anything full of beans. No, you I mean, are I full think of you've beans. You've got ants in your pants. You can't stop your legs moving. I do have. You ants just want to go pants. run around and I want to eat wanna some beans or something. I want to be I free know. in the world. Run around. Well, um, you won. Now you get your prize money to spend on beans. Oh, that's that's many cans of lost beans. <laughs> is it? Yeah, yeah I, c I reckon a can of beans so is like a dollar. We're getting more and more people, right? Yeah. So uh, I feel things have changed in more the few people, weeks I haven't less been here. entrance. Really? Yeah. Only eleven entrance. Oh. Because I, I remember I signed up to uh, the event on Sunday yesterday, and there was like some names. There were only five people, including me, signed up currently. But there was like a bunch of people's names I hadn't seen before. There was Scraddles. I recognized him. Then everyone else's names, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. We're all, it's all fresh. And also, even though, according to the seating, none of them were seated, but I was seated fifth, dead last. So, you know, something they don't, it, it can't quite factor them in, but it knows whatever they are. It must be, I must be lowered now. That's it unfortunate. Knows the details. At least you got a seed. Apparently. I mean, it might. It probably updates. You know what I have to say about the recent uh, increase in entrance and uh, attendees? More money, more problems. I mean, we've got to have a bigger room now. Kai's under serious strain. There's How memes all, uh, bounding all over the place. I don't know. What do you? What do you? What do you mean by that? What's the? What's the stress? Isn't this a similar? I just played more than more two room? rounds in a in a tournament. Don't you always have to play more than two rounds? There's like, you know, winners finals, grand finals, and there's at least one other round. Then there's a bye, right? So there's like, that's three rounds. Yeah, so I maybe you got to play four now? Had, I had a gamer, uh, McLeod. Oh, yeah. He's, he's a gamer. Such he's a gamer. A gamer. He's, he got seated below Will D and below, I mean, uh, hey. what's his name? That other guy. I mean, you know, hey. the, the, the guy who doesn't, he's not a gamer. You know the guy. Caleb? Bailey. Caleb? Ba no, Caleb is a gamer. <laughs> Bailey is not a gamer. I don't know. Caleb sold me his PS4. He only owned one game on it. <laughs> so, <laughs> the fucking point. <laughs> what exactly. game was it? It was Dark Souls 3, which is a good oh, game. Oh, of but, course uh, it was Dark Souls 3. He's a Dark Souls fanatic. He, he even plays Demon Souls. Big gamer. Caleb yeah. doesn't. He's not about the breadth of the experience of he's life. About he's the, about depth. Yeah, he's about the cash, the money. Yeah, exactly. He's he's laser focused <laughs> on all. whatever is his his task. You know, at, at the time. That's. Kind of like That's Muta probably King. true. Yeah, he's kind of like Muta King. You know, to me, he, he kind of does remind me of a robot in some ways. Yeah. You know what I mean? He's like Especially SA today's Muta robots, King. which are not that advanced and can only do one task. Robots in the future, like in sci-fi movies, actually probably better at melee than Caleb. <laughs> I mean, they're probably better than most of us, if not all of us. Oh, yeah. I mean, if I was a robot, I imagine I'd be pretty good at, at melee. Like, Why? Like, what, like, what like an android. What? Like, it, like, a like, world, like, like a sci-fi, like a sci-fi, like a sci-fi android, right? You know, like a, I have all the mental functioning of a peep of a person, but I'm a robot. Surely, I'd how would be, being a robot help? I'd have like the Do reactions. Have I'd have the frame perfect execution. Press one in chat. The frame perfect. <laughs> no one's talking. Nobody <laughs> said anything watching. in chat. Nobody said anything in chat. So I like, can't believe my phone ran out of batteries. Okay, the last thing said was at seven thirty. by scattles. Do you have Clyde's number? <laughs> Why I don't have. have I don't have. Cl I have a working phone, but I don't have Clyde's number. You can send him a text from this and say, "Hey, it's wait." It's my lemons. phone's gonna turn on. My phone's gonna turn on. I get, uh, 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 It's gonna turn on. Okay. I just have to get to the number. Be it's ready sorry. with your number entering finger, because it'll only be a fleeting. Oh, you don't know. Instance. You don't know your good friend Clyde's number. No. You don't want to speak it out. Well, you have to speak it out to me over the over I know the it's mic. A phone number. You, know, you, you might want to. <laughs> you might want to enter it instead of speaking no, it I, out. No, I'll, I'll. I'll tell you. Because I want to say it out think, loud so that I remember it if something goes wrong. You think Clive will appreciate that? And also, I can watch the VOD to find out the number, even if... <laughs> How? Because <laughs> I'll be saying it. I might even... No. When it's ready, I'll put it on the screen. Mm. Oh, you type it in chat? No, you know who, I, who hasn't contacted me in, uh, in a long time? Me? No, Junior. Oh, that guy. That, I, took me a second. He's gone. What do you mean he's gone? He just upped and went. In the middle of the night. You think maybe he'd, he'd had enough of your shit? I think he'd had enough of owing rent to me. <laughs> oh, did he not pay? Did he skip out on rent? He, you know, he assured me he was good for it eventually. <laughs> and Which, then, then know, left with like a wistful look in his eye, one tear rolling down his face. I, I assume that's what bag he looked like when he left at 5 a.m. <laughs> in the morning. He wasn't bagging a stick. He left with all his yeah. fishing shit to go it's fishing like, uh, and then he just never came back. Oh, yeah. With the, it's got a stick at least for the fishing rod. 
It's like uh, so have you seen well, you've seen Wallace and Gromit, right? Where Gromit leaves tearfully yeah. in the night. It's like that. Hold Tragically. On. My phone is so slow. He finds he is no longer at home at his at his home and must must depart. Uh Clyde Stanfield. Fuck, I went to the wrong thing. Uh, oh, uh, one Clyde? Uh, oh no. Uh, um information. Tell me the info. Zero four two two. Zero four two two nine six zero nine six zero one six three one six three. All right, we're we're gonna gonna write it. that down. Whoever's <laughs> in chat. All right, tell Clyde where, where I'm coming. Okay. Ask if he's eaten. Say uh, your lemons. Oh wait a minute. Oh, oh shit. Now you can call uh -oh. Clyde whenever you want too. Did I you hit. I hit the wrong button. All right, there we go. Anyone in chat? You can now call Clyde whenever you like. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> feel, feel feel free. Preferably often. Uh, what's his last name, by the way? Stanfield. So Clyde Stanfield. Address 2 slash 4 oh, Bassett Street, Grand Park, park. And phone number, I've already been through it. This, are they giving out your own, uh, your own uh, thing? Yeah, I'm moving out. Are you? <laughs> yeah, in a month or so. Okay. Just leaving, leaving behind a gift for your buddy Clyde. I mean, Clyde's moving out too. Oh. Okay. Well, I'll, I can tell you his parents' address. Uh, I don't <laughs> need that yet. You don't need Clyde's parents' address? Not yet. Well, I don't know when you would need it. I mean, I don't know either, but I mean, it's never, it never hurts to be prepared, you know. That's true. Stan. D. Stand. Stanfield. Field. Do you know, previously I used to live with a guy called Dale Buttfield and also Clyde Stanfield. How fake does that sound? I had to write who my tenants were on, on applications for things. Buttfield and Stanfield. That and also Clyde's uh, Dale is a type of horse. I'll be honest. <laughs> that, that's fake. That, that does not seem uh, legitimate. I don't, yeah, well, is obviously. That, is that correct? Yeah, Clyde's forefathers were obviously dyslexic. That is correct. Yeah, that is correct. All right, well, you didn't say anything. You just looked at it and then like, all right. Yeah, Stanfield, S-T-A-N-D-F-I-E-L-D. -E Son right. of Jeff and Jenny. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Jeff Stanfield, I assume. Wait, message. Uh, I don't know. You know what? I have like 10% of batteries. I could just... <laughs> <laughs> What's the point of this? The point is... Uh, no, actually, I just ran out. Okay. okay. It kind of hovers on 10% before it dies. Oops. I was going to say I could use the last bit of my battery to like... Yeah, what kind of, is that a flip phone? No, it is not. I was excited when I was getting... Because I was like, oh my god, I'm going to get a flip phone because it's so old, but it's just a slidey thing. No, that's shit. Yeah. Wait a minute. So I have to use this thing. It'll take a while. Shout out to us still talking on stream. Yeah. It's none of this needs to be on stream, but for for, for Kai's sake later when he's re <laughs> when he's doing the VODs. Yep. Uh. Oh, Musket's playing Ultimate. That's oh, yeah. dope. Yeah, I believe he does that on occasion. How, have you played Ultimate? I have. Dude, I want to play Ultimate, but only against Musket. Okay. So there's nothing at stake. Yeah, and I, I think I can read him. <laughs> yeah, I played the 30 minutes of a uh, three-player free-for-all with Stage Morph on. Did you I win? wasn't very good, no. It'd been too long since I played. I don't know, I used to be, like, I used to be better than all my friends, and now I'm, like, worse than all my friends. I played it's too much you, melee. It's because you have too much tech skill and uh, you try I mean, to do advanced I partly techniques. that is true, because I kept trying to L-cancel, and that just fucked me up. Dude, air dodging off stage is such a real thing. Mm. You like you just press L. Think about the the controllers because I have like the trigger trick in mind is that like I just accidentally press L all the time because for some reason you don't need to fully press L down to air dodge. Oh, like it like L canceling in. What, what are you doing by the way? You I'm just typing really you're slowly. Time. I'm not this. <laughs> right, this, is, this is an old freaking thing. I have to I have to type out each letter individually. And you just, just and you, I'm trying to talk to you, you at the same predictive. time. <laughs> No. <laughs> it's predictive. Mm. Predictive is better. Actually, I don't think this even has predictive. There's no way that your phone it doesn't, doesn't have predictive right, text. It, it has predictive text when I'm using the web browser, but it doesn't have predictive t predictive t uh, their text when messaging people. What are you texting him anyway? Uh, your Nick's phone died, so send me your response is what I'm going to put next. No, no, no. Just say Nick's phone died. We're going to be there uh, <laughs> at some point. Have you eaten? Response. I don't want to type all that. Nick's phone died. Have you eaten? I'm already typed out half. Just of let what me I fucking call say. him, dude. <laughs> <laughs> all right, fine. I'll just delete all of this. I'm calling it now. It's calling. 
All right, see you later, gang. Whoever's, is there even any viewers? Yes. Since the tournament's all over. Uh, I can't see where it says. Here it is. I'm uh, checking if there's any viewers. Just seeing who was watching. It's all over. Yeah, yeah it's all over. Yeah. Um, and we just spent the last yeah, 10 I'll minutes rambling about stuff that's not important to anything. That's pretty good. Uh, I'm going to like stop the stream now. But thank you for yeah. watching, everyone. Um, yes, follow at SA Smash Central on Twitter. Follow me on mm. Twitter at KB Kaiser. And uh, um, tune in Sunday, right? Yeah, so Sunday, uh, Cheese League round two. Uh, we're going to have like cool logo and stuff. Um, but yeah, as you can see here, uh, I'm just going to quickly like change. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so check out the venue we've got at the moment. So we got the old Unibar venue. It's pretty big. And we got all these friendly setups. But also, we've got the whole stage for us. That's sick. We've got all this setup. We've got the projector going as well. We're getting infinite windows now. Um, nice. But yeah, pretty exciting, in my opinion, for Sunday as well. Yeah, I'll be there. Yeah, come to come to Sunday. All day instead of the last ten minutes. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. Yeah, um, probably. So yeah, tune in then on Sunday, Cheese League round yeah. two. Also, I'm teaming with Caleb, and he told me that if I team with him, that we will win. So I'm just that putting you that will out there. win. He he stated it as a matter of fact. Will win. Hey, do you want to team with me? We will win. And I th well, I guess I'm sold. That was how. It That's went. pretty good, dude. All right, I'm going to end the stream. Right. Peace out, everyone. See you.